<laughs> but then they would have called it Wa Mario and Waluigi, but it's dumb. It's a stupid Hi. Name thing. Hello. Hello. Any game? Oh fuck! I do it. I did it again. What did you do? Oh, you said hello. I did the hello. Like I do that every time. Hey guys. <laughs> Hey, what's, what's up, guys? guys? What's up, guys? Welcome to Dungeon Select. Oh, God, I hate us already. I hate this already. Actually. Subscribe oh, for the V-Bucks giveaway. Oh, shit. Smash that bell. Right. Smash bell? Relax, dude. No. If you want, if you want more <laughs> of this content, you can check out the video down below. We made it a record. Check out the video over here. Harassment, guys. We did it. We, we think did this it. video is great. And this video was selected right. by Someone YouTube. changed the board. Which one's better? Oh. Welcome to uh, Dungeon Select uh, Session 6 of Campaign 2. Uh, yeah, no Soko this week. He is uh, on a trip to uh, Texas. He's hanging out with Bopo, which I'm, I'm, a little, golfing I'm, a little, right now. I'm a little jealous, like a little bit. But um, we're here. Laura's back. We were also down to Laura last week, but she's back. She has oh, reunited wow. with the cast, and it's going to be a good time. And it feels so good. Oh. I'm excited for this one. This is going to be a good one. I'm not. I Any don't like when DM happy. Announcements before we get going. Um, <laughs> maybe less like of an a... announcement, but a request. <laughs> okay. Johnny sent me the link to a really cool looking one shot that was made by the person who also made the combat wheelchair. And Laura's at her spending limit, but it's only three dollars. So if someone wants to buy Laura a one shot, I will stream it hey as man. the DM again. We have, uh, we have, uh, we have a, bu we have a budget now because of our Twitch paycheck. <laughs> <laughs> and we fit three dollars. I get. Budget. I mean, I just spent two dollars on a spell on the Indie Beyond, so I guess we can squeeze out three dollars okay. for that one you shot. You did what? <laughs> How dare you? That's our money. money. Oh, this is communism I now. Something for <clears throat> nah, I mean, we have the budget. We can we can we can spend three dollars. I, ha I literally I have I literally have anymore. classes on budgeting next week. <laughs> so. that's, that's fine. Uh, just get, send me a link and I'll, I'll get it for uh, for you, Laura. With uh, I mean, it's, also, it's also your money. You work work just as hard as the rest of us for that for that Twitch paycheck. It's our so, money. It's our yes. Money. Well, there you go. I and this time, right. work just as hard as everyone else here oh, yeah. on Dungeon Select. Me. Yep. Koi Every skill team. check is a group skill check. Do you need pay to win now? Buying spells? Yeah. <laughs> there it's, you go. it's gotten to so... that. Sweet. It's gotten to that. <laughs> In that God case, if we buy this one shot, then I'll run it this time rather than. Because before we had like some non DS players, the only like DS cast member aside from me was Bell. But this time, since we're using a DS paycheck, we can run it. So maybe like um, Dutch and like Duke and Ethan, since you didn't play the no. last one, if you guys want to be some of the players, I'm down to play some and D &D. then get to get fucked, Koiba. Like... <laughs> Literally get fucked. Literally. Well, you don't do anything to contribute, so you don't <laughs> get extra D and D. True. Like, <laughs> you're all. Well, just because I don't know how many, I need to check how many people it's for, because it'd be cool if we could get maybe one or two more that aren't the regular cast, but if it's only four, yeah, then it we'll would just a, be like we'll you looking. four. I'm down. I'm but down I would, and it'd be cool to do a bit of a mishmash. But are know. we still doing the, because uh, if so, that's dash. an announcement that I want to make. Are we still doing the Tasha's Kiss? I believe weekend? so. Like James like sent us the right? yeah next weekend. Uh, James so, doesn't send anything to um, the contrary. So. Next Saturday, we're finally getting back into the Tasha's Kiss one shot that we started a few months ago. James finally has time to finish running us through that that one shot. Um, so it's gonna be a good time. Some some familiar faces, some uh, not so familiar faces joining that. Um, was Opti a part of that? It was. I think it's Koiba, Shatter, Opti. you, me, and OSG, and then yeah. I think was Opti it was well. it just four? I think Opti was there a fifth? Was. I think it was. I don't think there was Opti. I don't remember. Playing Hold up! I'm just gonna go to YouTube quickly and look at the vault. Oh, Whoa! No! I spilled my drink. Oh, yeah, Opti as well. Opti, I'm remembering Opti being oh. there. I do was not. it was it the good uh, one? Oh no! <laughs> oh no! So yeah, that's that's oh, happening. No. Uh, I mean, we have a group chat, right? We could quickly check. That's what I was gonna do. Yeah. Fucking... Was it the good drink, Laura? It was not the good drink. Oh, the no, I'm a bad friend. You know what happened? This is the first Damn. day since I've had the new mouse pad. I broke my rule of no containers without a lid near the new Ooh. mouse pad. And the one time I did, look what I did. I did Get it. fucked, I guess. <sighs> um, so yeah, so that's going to be happening on Saturday. Last Thursday, but we it had missed a all electronics, discourse so we're with uh, Sir Duke. It was a cute That's little one-on-one. -on -one. Duke scored five out of seven on his trivia, so he's currently tied for first with Laura on the leaderboard. <gasps> Woo. What a game. Um, I have a small announcement about yep. the YouTube stuff. Yep. Um, because the game hated everyone last week or Baldur's earlier Gate. this week. Yep. Yeah. Of Baldur's Gate. 
Um, the episode will be out a little bit later on just because I'm doing some small editing ma magic. <laughs> no, I mean, I did, yeah. I, 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 At I, that I, point. I requested Bell to say, because that was like a two hour stream or whatever, but only half an hour of gameplay. So I told Bell, listen, we'll just stick this to the, the one for next week. And um, we'll make that one VOD for the YouTube because there's no point in uploading a VOD that is two and a half hours or one and a half hours, which is us crying and bitching because the game didn't want to work. Oh, <laughs> we yeah. put that on the other channel. Uh, yeah. so. <laughs> Let's go on our Patreon. <laughs> you want to listen to us scream and cry at each other? It'll be no, a little no, bit guys, more of a highlight reel. Hear me out. Pod. Plan. We make a fan house account for Dungeon Select, and the exclusive content we post is just the shit we say <laughs> while Dutch is deafened during the starting <laughs> soon. And that's what people get. Are you, yeah. call, are, are you sure about that? I feel like yeah, we can't like put shit some of it. We can't pull it's it probably a bad idea. But... Some of it's not always Twitch safe, but hey, it's not. It's, it's, not, it's not other people safe. It's just not other people safe. Exactly. <laughs> All right. So <laughs> next just Thursday, obviously, I... we'll have another dungeon discourse. Um, no one knows who's going to be on that yet. I don't even know yet. So we'll see how tonight goes. Yo, I won't. I won't be busy this time. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, you fucking dipped out like a day before. Twat, yeah. no, it's all good. No, it was like reminded, reminded of a prior commitment. Little, little one on one, you know, talking about I was about unfortunately his reminded of a prior commitment. The, I made the, a month the previous muting, You know, the deafening that uh, has been happening because mm. Duke has been having a lot of one on ones with me to, throughout the sessions. Don't Talked me, a bit about that uh, without going into too much spoilers, but it's, it's a good watch. Uh, it's on YouTube now, so go check it out if you haven't already. Uh, and then tomorrow, if fucking the game allows it. We're playing Baldur's Gate. <laughs> if not, yeah, we have a backup plan this time. If not, it's going to be Divinity Original Sin 2. Which so is Baldur's Gate, plan. but less yeah. broken. Which is yeah, yeah. less boulders. So Baldur's okay. Gate that isn't canon D&D. &D. Yeah. <laughs> I'm having Why a weird realization. Why are we in code the same person? Oh yeah, Duke? What's up? So, Anchor allows me only to upload files of a certain size. Yeah. But then I can have them... I can upload two files that then make one episode. Oh, really? So I've uploaded it in halves with like a little like, this is the end of part one and this is the beginning of part two. But I think it's just going to be one cohesive episode. I don't know if I'm going to be... I, so, I, I don't know. Okay, wait, wait, so, let me get this straight. so to upload the files, it needs to be a certain file size or smaller. Yeah. But you can edit them together on Anchor once they're there. Yeah. Yeah. Huh. Interesting. Fascinating. Yeah. That is interesting. <laughs> I'll leave the end of part one, beginning of part two thing in anyway, because yeah. obviously there's usually a big break there that I've cut out. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. All right. I think, I think I've think i cleaned all the beverage off. Good job, of proud ass. of you. Uh, other than that... I don't have an announcement, oh. but I do have a sneak peek. Oh? Ooh. Ooh, minis. It's a figurine. Minis? <laughs> that... Who has wings? Is that Bran? And then I've got this one just because I bought the the board game. No, it's not the cool. It's a it's a No, it's, it's, it's Ukatoa. This is Ukatoa. If you buy the Ukatoa board game, it comes with I a have mini. I have the same one. Uh, oh, wow. That comes uh, primed in grey, but I've primed it in black instead. But nice. Hey, I've also got Abram. <sighs> That's cool. Hell yeah. I could swap to the other camera and show when you better, the, but then when my are the, room like, When are the, the, the rumored Sellotape beanie painting streams finally happening, dude? Because I'm actually pissed. Yeah, you grimed them it. ready, so you in the next saying, week or two. You keep saying it, and it never happens. Yeah, I we were legitimately actually... Legitimately primed it. Me and Bell have been we, working we, we, we were talking a about it um, the other okay. day, so okay. actually, I'll need to talk to you about that later, but... Yeah, I, um, I don't want to spoil it on stream, but Bell and I were talking about me doing like a project mini, uh, something important from last campaign that's quite big and is going to take like multiple episodes to paint, which is terrifying. Orcus? Question mark. My penis. <laughs> it's big, yes, it's, it's Duke's big. penis. It's I've, big, I've, big, I've big, gone big, on one of those big. Etsy stores and got them to model <laughs> Gen's gonna be, penis. It's going to be the He's penis of like a, Gen's a alter cat. ego. <laughs> He sent me a casting, I had to put my dick in it and mm, then wait for weird. two minutes it's for it to like, bum up. And then, Going to uh, willy.com, baby. Anyway. <laughs> Last we left off, you ventured from Southwold through New Daramuth into the Slithering Jungle once more. With the use of uh, two horses and a cart that you stabled in New Daramuth and you proceeded on foot. Then you met a female Yuan-Ti ranger, Sirin, who got into a bit of a 
fights with a saber-toothed jaguar. Managed to win the fight, yeah. but uh, it left her wounded. Who you helped, and as a reward, uh, she took you to her tribe in Sethka, which turns out to be a tribe of yuan -Ti that don't mind the new settlers, the outsiders on their lands, have actually have a bit of a working relationship with the city of New Daramuth, uh, and they, they coexist. You met uh, their leader, Nuxa, who gave you a bit of information of what to expect in Sekta, and also granted uh, Sirin permission to travel with you so she could help you uh, out uh, along the way, and also when venturing in the, uh, the, the, the town, village, if you will. Um... We left off when you traveled through the night to Sethka. You had your discussions, you had your talks, and then you went to sleep. You all wake up now, after a long rest, towards the end of the afternoon. Uh, you, you exit your, your huts that you got given to, or you exit the temple that you uh, got given refuge in. To see a big fire in the middle of uh, a bit of an open space. A group of Yuan-Ti gathering around it. You can you can see some kind of uh, avian creature being roasted above a fire. And Sirin is also sitting there, stringing her bow. And kind of nods to you and motions you to come over. And uh, she has seemingly uh, saved some seating around the fire for you guys. Go take a seat. Mm. None of you are vegetarians, are you? Not, Not as far as I'm aware. Oh, we learn new things about each other every day. Look at us. Well, um, there's some freshly caught quails uh, roasting if you uh, are hungry. Suggest you eat up. We have a long trip ahead of us. Yes, we do. Yes, we do indeed. My I'm favorite say, fucking food, even if it's quails. It's quite a small bird. Yeah, but it's like there's like two spits with like five of them uh, on a uh, five of each on a spit. There's a, there's a bunch Any of eggies? them. Hmm? Quails, eggs? Any eggies? No eggies, just bird. None just of them are like a kinder just toy bird. with like a little egg inside. No. Just grown <laughs> burb. Just just burb. Just grown burb. <clears throat> oh, right, wait, we, we did long rest, right? Yeah. 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 Beautiful. Beautiful. So, you ready? What's yeah. to come? Uh, I suppose it will fucking ever be. Do we all need to take that shitty fucking remedy shit now? Or... Yeah, yes, we probably should. Be wise. Yeah, we probably should. Bonk. Out of curiosity, what exactly is to come? A gathering of tribes. Lots of yuan tea, including Rixal. A powerful priest of Seth. Presumably your freshly turned friend. And, well, a Hydra got mentioned. Unfortunately, yes. Mm. I'm kind of looking forward to see one, to be honest. Yeah, I'm looking forward to see one. Maybe not so far mm. up close, but you know, you know the Vegas phrase. Can't be curiosity won't be the last killed thing. the cat. I just give a it's... pointed look at that expression. Are there cats in the jungle? Other than obviously big cats, but like that domestic domesticated isn't the right. Are there like house cat-sized cats in the jungle? Or is that a thing? Not I just jungle. raised my hand. Ever killed a big cat. I do. I think you probably count as a big cat. To be fair. One was as big as you, Dagon. I'm not necessarily sure that I'd refer to you as domesticated. That might can be considered insulting in some places. I'm sure a skilled ranger would be able to maybe talk down a saber-toothed jaguar, but... I look at Davian. <laughs> look at Davian, everyone just... <laughs> I happen to know any skilled rangers. I could talk to one. I don't know about <laughs> one down. Oh, you could amp one up, could you? But couldn't. One down. Maybe you can no, get into a I discussion about politics. Just, you know, give it something to laugh about. There is something um, I did want to discuss with you. Yes, go on. 
think about a bit of a plan once we get there. The layout of, of, of the town is very similar to ours. Ziggurat in the middle, surrounded by round stone huts. Not much cover. Presumably, the fight will take place within the ziggurat. Ooh. How are you on stealth? You guys good at keeping quiet? I just give it Absolutely. thumbs Absolutely. I look at Jax, <laughs> who isn't here, but I still look at him and get him. I'm pretty good at stealth, big man. Not so much. I mean, Reasonably so. he, he's not terrible. He's definitely worse at strength-based things, but it's not as... Forte. Okay. Well, for our sake, I hope today is his lucky day. Because if we get caught before entering the ziggurat, we'll be fighting an army. Oh, fun. I don't suppose you have any tricks up your sleeve that might make it a little easier to get through there without being spotted. Unfortunately, I'm naturally pretty good at hiding myself. Not so much at aiding others, so. Never really had to. And we best hope luck's on our side. Ah, oh, fuck. How's the terrain from here to there? I know it's all jungle, but I suppose you know the. I know the routes the to take. Uh, I know a route to take that. Uh, we'll take us past the temple where we could rest for the night. It's an abandoned temple. We could rest for the night. Um, it's about a two-day trek. After we reach the I... temple, it's about another few more hours of traveling. This answers the question. We're leaving quite late, obviously, because we mm. travel through. Are we going to be doing a shorter day travel than a longer one, or are we traveling through the night again? It's up to you. Would you like no, to kind of arrive at... Group. Would you like to arrive at Sektha during the day or during the night? I suppose during the night is going to be more cover, but I don't know if we've got the advantage at night or day. How how sure? Well, how well how sure do dark you vision? see yeah, how? in the dark? Do you want to have the ability to see pretty well in the dark? Then daytime might be best. <laughs> I think most of us would be more at home, at least. That would mean we reach the temple at about a couple hours after midnight. We rest then, and then wake up, travel the last few hours. We'll arrive at the town at about noon. How similar is the layout of Seth Car here to Sekthar? Pretty much identical. Does that include the interior? No. Talking about the ziggurat specifically? That ziggurat... Um, ours is pretty straightforward. Rooms, stairways down. Theirs is a bit of a maze, a labyrinth. A network of tunnels that leads to a large chamber that houses a hydra, apparently. The hydra room. Yes. All the base, best ziggurats have them. I think it might be a different type of creature in each one, you know? Luck of the draw. Who is knows? it easy to get lost in this labyrinth? Is it something that you have navigated before? Mm, I've been inside a few times before. They decided they wanted to wage war upon anything that wasn't native to this land. But it's been a while. I'm not sure how much help I will be, but... Try. I mean, to be fair, Davian, it is. Sorry, I've got a quail. We've got a quail. Oh, I hate that one happened. I mean, it is called a labyrinth. It's not called the merry walkway. Well, I mean, sure, but it's a labyrinth that they live in, or at least around. They use it. It has a purpose, so surely they must go in there. I mean, and she now insane. looks. She now looks at Daigon. You're feline, cat-like, I suppose, right? I just look down at myself and look back at her. 
How's with a no of, shit expression on my face. How's your sense of smell? Thumbs up. I would imagine a Hydra carries quite a scent around it. Might be helpful. Well then. Let's finish up our dinners, boys. And girls. <laughs> and, uh... <laughs> get on our merry way. Unless there's more information we need to know about. Pretty sure. The sooner the better. Looks as, uh... Shared everything there was to share about. What to expect, so... Already taken a jungle remedy. Yep. The longer we wait, Very good. the more time we waste. Alright. Ready when you are. Yeah, we should travel as much as we can while we still got these, because this shit isn't cheap. Imagine. Please lead the way. You are our she, uh, she gets up and puts her puts her bow like on her back. One more time, checks her uh, checks her quiver and makes sure that it's stocked to the brim with arrows. All right, follow me. And she leads the way northeast into the jungle. She will be leading uh, the pack. Let me quickly, I forgot to open her character sheet. Hold on a moment. Mm, I believe I added her in the dungeon select. Yep, there we go. Okay. You see her kind of <clears throat> searching the ground, looking looking around the, the, the various trees. And a, a few hours into your trek, she kind of puts a hand up behind to, to notion to you behind to behind her, and she kind of stops and, and starts to crouch. Follow her lead. Mm -hmm. Yep. Be quiet. Okay. I would like for you all to roll stealth check, please. Okay. I'll roll Is for someone uh, rolling for Jax. I'll roll for Jax. Cool. Rolled off my tray. Okay. Who's combating Jax there? You or am I? I'll, I'll control Jax. It's all good. Actually, cool. I'm already controlling Siren. How about someone else take over? It'd be great. I'll do Jax I'm... again. I don't mind. Okay. Cool. Unless someone else really wants to. Um. You got all this nice and shit. Okay. Dude. I'm disappointed. Twelve for Jax. That's not too terrible. That's pretty good for Jax. Yeah, Dude, minus, Jax did better two. than me. <laughs> I rolled an 11. I rolled a 10. I rolled... 10? I rolled a 7 plus 5, 12, 12. plus 4, 16. You get a d4, yeah. right, on uh, yeah. stealth checks? Very nice. Okay. I got a 19. 19. I, got a, I got an 18. All right, very good. Uh, I'd say your group's average is good enough uh, to to remain hidden, as you see and hear passing closely by you this six-legged, large crocodile creature. Ooh! Is it kind of looks like so? It's like an avatar. Crocolisk, if you will. Um, <laughs> that kind of waddles its way past you. Kind of sniffing the air and then suddenly darts into a bush and you can hear just a a, a loud uh crushing noise as then it leaves the bush again and within its its large mouth it carries the a, a small a small um like almost like otter like creature it's very very Aww. similar to that and uh, it just carries oh, on its way. Alright. Let's keep going. And Siren gets up again and continues to guide you. You you get you oh. definitely see that this path you're taking is a pretty often traveled path, or at least used to be. Uh, a lot of the vines and, and the plant life that should be in the wave are, are all like cut down or or removed. Um you get the sense that this is a path that would typically be used when traveling from one town to another. <laughs> before they all hated each other. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. uh, the rest of your day goes by quite smoothly. And towards about two, maybe three in the morning, you arrive at a temple. 
no light sources from inside. Um, it looking abandoned, abandoned as Sirin told you about. All right. If you want to arrive at the town in the daytime, I suggest we make a pit stop here. Good. Um, on, on. Is it worth checking out this place first before we? I'm already on my way. I take that as a yes then. Okay. I'm gonna take a torch from my pack. Okay. And a tinderbox, and then, you know, light up a torch and go inside Indiana Jones style. All right. Uh, Hello, make Graham. a perception check because you were the first one to enter uh, the the temple. Can I guide him, or is he a bit too far away? If you want to catch up to him to guide him, you can. I'll catch up to him to give him guidance. Catch up to him to assist him? <laughs> to assist? I don't know. And, Where's and the DM? Can I, can nah, I assist him? Uh, Elazarin quickly manages to catch up to cast guidance, and that's when uh, they're both already in there. And I would like Stavian reception for 14. Mm. You look around, and uh, it's definitely dusty. It, it, no signs of anyone having been here very recently. Uh, you see in the corner of this chamber some, like, remnants of maybe what once used to be a bit of a campfire, suggesting that people have used this as refuge for the night in the past. Uh, but no sign of life, no sign of anything. Is it just one open room? Uh, it is, yeah. No corridors, no doors, nothing like that? No. It's a pretty small uh, structure. Old, old babby ziggurat? Yeah, mm -hmm. a little bit. Uh, I'll just sort of turn around and call out. It looks safe enough. And uh, are there any torch sconces? Are there any torches in the room? There are sconces with torches in them, but they're not lit up. The flames oh. have been doused. Are they? Do they have fuel in? Um, two of them. There's about six I'll, of them I'll, spread I'll light the room. Them up. Two of them seem to have enough oomph to to be lit up. I'll, I'll light up the two, and then just and you and my with my one, just try and place them around so that the room is fairly evenly lit. Okay. In the sconces. All right. And uh, pick a spot. Lay down my bedroll. Mm -hmm. I is it is there a is there a chimney? Like is it ventilated? Um, there are like uh, like gaps in the stonework towards the ceiling, yeah, that that, that allow the smoke to uh, clear out. Is there anything? In fact, I'll I'll have a look around. You said there was evidence that someone else had camped there before. Yeah. If they had anything of a fire of sorts, if there's any sort of good-looking kindling or anything like that, and then um, fucking torches that won't light, and I'll just throw them all together to start okay. a small fire. Um, yeah, I'll say that you managed to do that. Uh, if you're also using the like torches that don't want to light up anymore, and uh, there are there is some like small remnants of that campfire that that, that you could you could use. There's still a bit of uh, kindling there that hasn't been uh, burnt up all the way. Beautiful. Hearing what Davian said earlier, saying it so seemed fine, uh, I want to go follow him in. And remembering what Siren said, can I just like take, sniff the air to see if does it smell like any other creatures aside from just like general jungle animal smells? But mm -hmm. anything that would stick out, like something's been here recently and left their scent. Make a perception check. <laughs> Natural one. Nope. Too many Not smells. <laughs> Too many smells. Too many jungle smells. Yeah. It smells like jungle in here. You're like, it smells, smells like jungle. Like jungle. <laughs> That's the that's um, next tile. Sirin kind <laughs> of goes jungle. to uh, sit down by the fire, and uh, I'm curious. Given you are fighting my kind, why didn't you respond more hostile when you saw me? Not at all. I mean, you were harmless. Uh, yeah, no harmless, and also, you, auntie. I mean, yeah, we, why should we paint everyone with the same brush? Not all humans are the same, not all elves are the same, not all you auntie are the same. There are bars really everywhere, and there are nice people everywhere. It's no awfully wise, I'm sure the majority of people would disagree with you. You weren't in a position to do much, so... What's the majority of people? You might still prove useful somehow. 
And if you murder us all in the sleep, we made a poor call in judgment. Who knows? We could know. have done that last night. Or this oh, afternoon, uh, you could be um, smart enough to trick us to be here. <laughs> far away. Dutch. I'd give it a look at you. Yes, yeah, smart enough to trick you and kill you when I'm alone and not backed up by my tribe. Right. Question. I'd give it just a smart. <laughs> yeah. Would I, because I wasn't here last week, has there been any indication that uh, if I, whenever I've used any sign language, did Siren look to have any comprehension or no? Like, do I think that Siren knows sign language or Thieves no. can't sign language? Okay. Then I won't say anything. All right. If you trust me, I'll take first watch. <laughs> I mean, if you don't want get me wrong, I. I think you're useful to have around, but don't take it personally if I Fair enough. don't want to leave you on a watch. Your loss. I'll take the I'll take the first watch. If that works out. You take the second watch if you want, sir. Sure. Siren sees in the dark better than I do, so I mean we're uh... sleeping late we're sleeping later at night, so Surely I'll just raise really my hand, uh, yeah. just volunteering, and also uh, go like this and gesture at my eyes, implying my dark vision is yeah. also very good. I'll, I'll take fourth. So, so, Diagon, are you taking third watch or second with... I believe she's taking third. Or... I, I shrug in a non-committal, doesn't matter. I'll, I'll... Way. She'll take third. I'll, I'll join Siren on second watch, you know, maybe we can... Have a chat and chill out, maybe. Well, it, as long as one of you can see, and then you can just make sure she doesn't kill us. It's really good. Well, perfect, Fair right? Enough. Again, no, no offense. Don't taken. don't take it personally. I want to do this with anyone that joined along with us. It's nothing to do with the fact that you're, you know, wasn't implying. I'm just paranoid. You paranoid? Never guessed it. Right, in that case, I'm going to close my eyes for uh, a couple of hours. Just wake me up when it's my turn. Will do. And she kind of finds a cozy spot against the wall, so still somewhere close to the to the fire, and just kind of sits against the uh, against the wall and closes her eyes. Um, I'm gonna wait an hour and then try and stuff my bedroll to make it look like there's someone in it before I disappear into the vessel to sleep. Uh, I will watch. <laughs> the Lazarin has a watch. Like it has first yep. watch, right? Yeah, but we're all in our tents, aren't we? No, 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 we no, no we're in the cigarette, so we, we don't. Oh, we are, aren't we? Did we not put our tents up in it? No, we never no. said we put no the tents up. I'm putting my tent up in it. Fuck okay. you, guys. <laughs> Wait, you freak. I'm not. Fair if enough. you started to, I'd be like, oh, well, that's just a waste of time, Brooks. We're under a roof, <laughs> we might as well. What do you, what do you peg it to, to keep it up? It's yeah. Stoned. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Wait, anyway, when he um... um when when he's messing around with his tent, I'm gonna minor illusion it so it looks like there's a giant tarantula just like hiding in his stuff. Fuck me! <laughs> I throw a rock at it. Uh, as you as you throw a rock, uh, the 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 rock kind of just phases through the 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 illusion. I'll reel oh. around and look at the two spellcasters and see which one's giggling like a child. <laughs> I'm also giggling Brooks. watching this, like giggling hilariously. Yeah, but I'm smart enough to know that you don't do the magic thing. It's one of those rare no, I, I'm just letting you know that I'm Brooks, giggling hilariously. Because I know exactly what just happened and who did it. Wait, what was that? What was that, Davian? <laughs> I said it's one of those rare phasing jungle spiders, Brooks. <laughs> They're very deadly. Do your I fucking believe him on this? Do I believe he's telling the truth? Inside. Do I get advantage given the fact that Kess is giggling like a fucking child? She, she would giggle if you were being attacked by a spider. Is, like, that regardless. is true. That is yeah, true, actually. That's, that's true. a good point. So, no. <laughs> okay. Insight? Yeah. Insight, yes. I only have a plus one, but it is a natural 20, so. Oh. I only have a plus one. I did get five. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's um, close. That means he might not believe you. You do not believe him. That's all. I'm, I'm going to make this spider start dancing. How, what sort of dancing are we talking? Is it slow dancing or is it like da 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 da? I can. Waving his little legs around. Don't look at it. 
No, that's it's, it's, it's doing it's, the it's fucking like, dance um, or charm you into a seductive it, like, trance. It spins on two legs. It's, and, oh, I can't like, remember the name of the dance. Like the Russian, like do 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 do. Cossack dancing. Cossack dancing. Yes, a Cossack Shireen dancing kind of spider. Kind of and looks at you all, and just sighs, and then closes her eyes again. <laughs> I I, I want to sign to Kess. Oh, that reminds me. We should really find a place to get more itching powder at some point. Just gonna laugh. <laughs> I you all wonder why so I wanted to with go that to the said, fucking tent. Brooke somehow manages to get his tent up in the middle of a stone structure. Somehow. Keeps me away from spiders and gives me some fucking privacy. Mm. And people Using think a it's hammer funny. drill and raw plugs. First, he manages to get first watch. He does it with just... Root like, anger. This is just vibing for like an hour of this first watch. <laughs> mm -hmm. Like, you're right there. Kiss. Just awake. Mm, just you know like you... for an hour, just kind you of know, like lying you know, in the bedroll. You know, you know you can go to sleep, right? Oh, you're lying in the bedroll? Never mind. No, I'm just lying in it and like trying to stuff it behind me with the clothes that I have, extra clothes, so that when I disappear into the vessel, it doesn't all collapse. <laughs> make a... Make a stealth check. Can't make a perception <laughs> check. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> fuck. <laughs> Wait, I think where's my plus four? Okay, okay. Uh, twelve. Fifteen. You can see Kess kind of stuffing stu stuffing things in her in her sleeping just bag. Look at her a little bit, just like trust. Don't don't say anything. I just stare. Just a little bit, just. The ground. Does he fucking disappear? <laughs> I mean, is 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 Kesslin? She, she she waits like an hour into the watch, and then she like uh -oh, mooses. You yeah. I mean, if you do that, yeah, you see her suddenly just disappear. The noise. Okay. Oh, I'll, I'll, I'll cast Detect Magic. Just as like to see if there's anything like residual over that area. Okay. Uh... I mean, for the purposes of this, the vessel <laughs> remains, <laughs> right? <laughs> Bill? Yeah. Like, yeah, it does. And the vessel, <laughs> I would say, is a magic item. There's just this glowing... So you do sense glow. there's something magical stuffed in her sleeping bag? Oh, I... I, oh, I, I I will like try to see what it is. Okay. But past that, I'm not gonna like. I'm not gonna pick up a touch. I'm just gonna see what it is and just. Do I recognize it as the like? What uh, right what does your vessel look like, Bill? It it looks like this. It's a tiny little uh, kind of jade green, uh, crystal bottle, on a silver chain. Is it the? Have you like it's worn a... it quite outwardly before, or has it been? Like, yeah, she away? wears it around her neck all the time, and she she grabs it. Um, when she's casting magic. Yeah, her oh, magic geez. flavor, she's mentioned like holding it and yeah, magic yeah. coming from okay. it and stuff. It's go. what she whispers into sometimes as well. Yeah, okay. I'll, I'll just look at it and then I'll go back on my watch properly and it's like, hello? hello? <laughs> no, no. no, I don't, I don't touch it. I just, I put everything back how I think it was and mm. just kind of okay. leave it. It's just a tiny object. Um, that is your watch done. It goes Where by. We? up Siren and then Burks and before I wake up Burks I will say to Siren Do you want to see the world how I see the world? Huh? And I'll use the um, eyes of the night on her so her dark vision expands to yes. 300 feet oh, all right, all right. Is This is how you normally see? <laughs> well, not always but at night time it is I feel like I can see sense. <laughs> I kind of nudge Brooke away. Brooke's awake. Brooks, it's time to get up. All right, I'm up. Take care. No, I'll go to sleep. I'll just put out my bedroll and just fucking. During your watch, you see Siren kind of whip out her quiver and kind of sharpen some of the arrowheads. With the, with some with some rock that's like with some like uh, with like a sharpening stone that she has uh, with her belongings, she just kind of looks at you every once in a while. I have to ask, 
What's the deal with the tent? Do you want the comedic answer or the truth? I really care. Just trying to pass the time. I don't like having a little bit of separation. Just as a sense of wanted some time for at least a couple hours on my own. Everything's been very uh, fast paced and hectic this past week or so. Past couple of weeks actually since I met Jax. Uh, plus there's less chance of waking up with spiders on me, which... Well, how do you know there's no spiders in there yet already from the last time you packed it up? Trust me, I checked very fucking thoroughly last time I packed it up. Okay. Not a fan, especially not... Like, here, here I was thinking, like, you know, back where I'm from, when you get spiders, it's, you know, when it's fairly cold, they come inside because of the fucking weather, and, you know, you find cobwebs in corners. So here I am, like, oh, fucking new continent, jungly, warm, less spiders. Absolutely fucking not. <laughs> More spiders. More not happy spiders. about it, I tell you. If anyone makes an enchanted, like, spider ward or some shit, I'm all over it. So how long have you been traveling with these people? One week. 22nd now, isn't it? So, so yes. actually, uh, eight days, eight days from today. Um, and yeah, since, since the, uh, the festival, which was the 13th. So, well, so today is our eighth day. Humor me, and if this is secret or anything, fair enough, but... Secret. How is it that six strangers get pushed together in a group to fight... To, to, to dismantle a war that is brewing? You wonder how we ended up traveling together or how we as a group have ended up doing this shit suppose the answers to both questions should be very similar no i mean i sort of got pulled into this shit because Jax couldn't just watch shit happen but uh there was an assassination attempt at the the festival and oh. in our own little groups we all somehow managed to end up bumping onto the same sort of road and at that point I was bored and wanted to follow along to see what happened and then we from that ended up getting a job which wasn't bad pay and then we sort of just followed the track of that and it's gone from being like go here talk to this person and potentially bring him in to now like take down a fucking cult and save a hydra and to be honest it's spirals very fucking quickly but at this point if i back out of it then i've spent the last however many days doing whatever the fuck we've been doing for so no no money you started this trip in a city called eldilon right yeah yeah are there any of my people in that city have i seen any sneak people in the city other than the ones we killed no. When you say your people, do you mean your people do that have so far live there among city folk? Your auntie, as as a general, broad group, or your group specifically? <sighs> yes, there's fucking your auntie in the city. Some of them were under the city and weird fucking creepy out of things and we killed quite a lot of them and okay. apparently there's, there's the some question. that are disguised do you want to live among your people that your people are aware of and are friendly to not that i've met but uh, there, there's reasonable diplomatic relations right i don't see why it wouldn't happen as long as you're not like trying to eat babies and I'm thinking you know it's obviously our tribe has connections with New Daramuth and 
work together pretty well, but that's only one city. Do you reckon, say we all survive this ordeal, would you reckon I could travel back there with you? You present me to whoever is in charge and allow me to perhaps try and build relations with my tribe in Eldilon like we did with New Daramath? I mean, that's probably more of a conversation to have with with either Davion or Elastrin because they have a bit of a better rapport with the leadership is from what I could tell, but I don't see why not. I okay. don't think it's necessarily like I I don't think it's off the table, put it that way, but bearing in mind when you meet this woman that she got shot by you auntie like a week ago, so you know. Oh no, they might all secretly be horrible fucking racists and I guess we'll find out when when it happens, but I would like to think that they're all right people. I, you know, I haven't experienced any horrible biases to Yuanti or any other monstrous peoples. Okay. I'm <clears throat> just, just, just thinking out loud more than anything. I feel like it could benefit both my people as well as the city case they need to organize some excursions into the jungle and whatnot which i'm sure might they will be, uh, this might be a really in insensitive question that i genuinely don't know but uh hmm? the auntie drink yeah anything in particular or just whatever it's about anything we can get our hands on how long have we got left on our watch at this point? About an hour. You're about halfway. About an hour. I'll pull out the the five whiskey and pour out a little amount. Mm -hmm. I will pass it to Siren. Takes it. It's strong, so. She kind of looks at the like. Isn't it like a little cup or what is it? What did you pour it in? Or did you give it a bottle? Uh, I passed her the bottle in the little cup. There's only Brooks only has one cup, so okay. he took like half a shot and then passed her the cup and bottle. Pours herself a little a little shot and kinda looks at looks at it, gives it a little sniff. And then you can see her kind of <clears throat> That is strong. It's quite nice though. Yeah. Condensed for travel, let's say. Mm. <clears throat> All right. So your group. Any any plans for the future? Like after this is done, you going to just go your separate ways again, or? I don't know if anyone's really thought that far ahead, to be entirely honest, or if they have, we haven't discussed it as a group. I mean, at the very least, I know that Jax has hung around like a bad smell, but. I mean that in the nicest way possible. I, we have a few projects that I think we want to work on together. So, I think he'll be around for a while. As for the, the other, I don't know. I mean, if it continues to be a fortunate making, where we're all earning good money, I don't see why not. I don't have any personal issues with any of them. Some of them are a bit more closed off than others. I have but... to ask the tabaxi. Mm. She doesn't speak. Is there a reason? There is, but I think that's maybe not my not my thing to tell sort of thing. Fair enough. It's just but not you can... often I meet people that aren't my own that I get to spend some time with, so I just have a lot of questions, and I, since you're awake, I figured I'd ask you. You can always ask tomorrow, and she'll relay it through, through Cass. But I just... That's one of the things that I feel like maybe isn't my... I, I don't want to upset her by, by telling her that's all. 
I understand. And with that, you kind of you kind of just do some more like chit chat, small talk, and eventually your watch is up. Upon which she trusts you to wake up the next person in line, and she goes back to her little spot by the wall and. Uh, We'll wake up. Uh, Dagon. Hit me. Hello. No, good, you're awake? Nod, yes. Alright, um. I'm gonna get off the bed then, just. You know, oh, some... also, you would have seen how I was sleeping. You noticed Dagon was slightly curled up and, like, oh, holding God. the meerkat plushie that she won <laughs> at, the, at the fair and just, like, cuddling it. That's it's fucking so adorable. Cute. Okay. I was gonna say give us a give us a shout if you need anything, but just you know, come come kick the fucking tent or something. I'll just nod. And then I'm gonna go for my watch. I wanna go climb to the top of the ziggurat on the outside and watch perched on the top. <laughs> That's fucking cool. Okay, uh, make a Well, because what's the point staying inside? I can only yeah, see true. the doorway. This true, way true, I can true. see everywhere. Make a perception check. Okay, this dice might get thrown away. It's not doing well. Um, 15. 15? You sit perched on top of the ziggurats, looking around. And I take my meerkat with me, keeping your, <laughs> holding on to it. While keeping your, uh, your, your ears out. And um, you see and hear, you know, the, the usual nighttime jungle sounds. Several animals just kind of doing their thing. The, you know, the, the nocturnal kind. Um, other than that, pretty quiet. Uh, you can see kind of from where you're at um, a variety of different birds kind of kind of perched on nearby branches of trees that kind of surround the clearing in which the temple is, has located, uh, is located in. But nothing really catches your eye, nothing that you feel raises the need to wake up anyone and your watch goes by. At this point, sun is uh, sun is coming up because you guys went to bed pretty late. Yep. Who do you wake up for that watch? Uh, was it? Oh shit! Was it supposed to be Davian or Lazarus? I think it was supposed to be. No, who was it? Am I waking up? I don't know. I'm wake up, Kess. I think it's Kess. I'm wake up, Kess. <laughs> okay, at this point, is Kess? Uh, yeah, Kess has. I was gonna say, what do I yeah. see when I go to wake up, Kess? Kess is now back in the bedroll. All right. She has put away the clothes that she had stuffed the bedroll with and is pretending to be asleep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Is she doing the like, like an eight year old, like, <laughs> like fake how snoring? I, I how, I, how I wake her up is I rather use my claws and poke her with the meerkat plushie until she opens <laughs> her eyes and the meerkat face is just like looking at her face. Just holds <laughs> well, that's a new way to wake up. And I just sign. I think it's cute. I love it. And I'll go back. And I'll just sign. I saw nothing. Uh, and then I go back to bed holding my plushie. All right. Kess. Yep. What do you do for your watch? Anything uh, in particular? She's going to, like, basically clamber around on the ziggurat. And just have fun. Fair enough. While she's on watch. Like a kid mm -hmm. in a jungle gym. Uh -huh. uh, make a perception check. <laughs> Okay. Ooh, perception is plus six, so twenty-one. Twenty-one. You look around while this. you're clambering onto the on top of the ziggurat. Um, at this point, sun's fully up. Uh, you can hear the various jungle creatures waking up to start their day too. Goes paired with a lot of different animals making making their usual like calls to to just just a lot of noise, a lot of ruckus. Um but eventually at about at about uh ten in the morning, ten eleven, uh the rest of you all wake up. And it is the next day. Woo. Say ten in the morning, you'll arrive. Twenty yeah, seconds. <laughs> Everyone sleep well, I assume, and I s try to make on eye contact with Cass, just like looking her direction. Everyone sleep well, I assume. I slept a wonderful day. Thank you. 
Good to um, me too don't well forget your jungle remedy. Oh, where the fuck everybody. you guys were sleeping? Because I slept like shit. I'd much rather be in a fucking comfy bed somewhere. Probably because you had the tent up. Yeah, that might. Be yeah. I hold, I hold my plushie out to Brooks and offer it when he says he slept bad. <laughs> your trim is showing. <laughs> <laughs> I appreciate the offer, Dyke, and maybe, yeah, uh, maybe next time. What do you mean? It's, it's cause like I have the tent up. The tent isn't gonna make the floor more fucking more uncomfortable, is it? It's about- it was all about the ambience. Yeah, the-, the Yes, the that really helped with sleeping on fucking- on a I'm... bedroll on bare stone. You d you're fucking not used ambience. To rough you're not used Ooh. to rough sleeping. So that'd be right no. up your alley. I'll also... What the fuck do you mean? I walk around in this shit. Do you think I sleep <laughs> on the fucking streets? I also uh, point I mean, to, sometimes. to his tent, and then I gesture it go like this, as if like for like fanning yourself because it's really hot. Where the fuck would you get turned on by a tent? <laughs> Just like, and that's like oh. actually throws her hands up, and I sign to Kess. <laughs> I mean, it must get stuffy in there. That won't help with sleep, air circulation. I'm pretty sure he understands what you were trying to say. He's just being a dick. And, and I just go, oh yeah, yeah, it makes sense. It checks out. That, like that, that kind of nod. A bit harsh. It was maybe some light-hearted comedy, but not that bad. And surprisingly, I'm, you know, reasonably comfortable in warm weather. Uh, I'm also gonna sign back to Dagen. We definitely need more itching powder. <laughs> I mean, have you ever had sex while camping? It's fucking intense. <laughs> like Dagan yeah. does the little like the laugh that she then tries to play off as like <clears throat> noise. Like I wasn't laughing. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> was me. Sirin gonna greet you all and morning. Whips out a, a dried fish from her from her pack and starts nomming on it. Oh, yeah, ration I'll the, time. I have a ra oh, yeah. ration. I should go the jungle remedy ration. for breakfast. Yes, yeah, did jungle remedy. Yeah. Stuff doesn't taste any better. How many today. did we buy? I know I, I spent nine gold. We on bought it. How off for there and back. Yeah, you got yeah, seven. Okay. You got seven each. Okay, cool. So, which is why it was like nine gold each. Yeah, cool. So you got. You should in yeah. theory have four left if I'm counting it right. Yeah. Okay. Cool. All right. I need to yeah. mark down a ration. Yeah, mark down a ration. That's why I've I've marked down two rations because obviously like probably dinner as well right so i think i don't know if you I also got sure extra in the, in the like item description of a ration is one ration is oh is it, is it what day. oh is yeah. it per day oh never yeah. mind then I it's probably like because each, each package of rations it's like three oh, meals in that like yeah. package i also so i think like you also pack. got some from jolly as well what yeah um, who ration. before we left oh the barkeep who's yeah. jolly smile you know who jolly is because i have 13 so it's only yeah, one I have, thing for me. I had 14. Oh yeah, okay, cool. Just yeah. making sure that okay. Yeah, I'm good. I'm cool. covered. Alright. You ready when you are? Lead the way. And so she will. You I roll up the tent and check for spiders. Make an investigation check. It's so funny if you found a spider. It'd be funny oh. if it's like, yeah, you actually found it. Funny if you didn't find a spider. Investigation six. <laughs> But you can tell there's no spiders. But oh. there is one on your head. That is illusional. <laughs> if it's on my head, how the fuck am I gonna see it? When it like crawls down in front of your eye. You have it crawl down in front of my face? <laughs> yeah. That's <laughs> fucking <laughs> horrifying. Why would you do that to someone? <laughs> right, that oh is, that's what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> it just like disappears. All right. I turn around. I look at fucking Cass and Lazarin. That's what not in my there... will. That's not in my wheelhouse. I look at Cass. Why are you looking at me? Well, he says that he can't do it, and I'm inclined to believe him. Do what? Illusory magic. Of what kind? Of the school of illusion. Oh, Kess, cut him some he's not, kind. He's not that okay. much of an idiot, even if he looks it. I, I don't necessarily do much in the way of magics, but illusion is something that I'm all about. Even non-magical illusion. Illusion is something that's very much 
something I've come to reasonably understand. Magic tricks? Yes, but not important at the moment. Oh, no, you have to show us. I'll show you a magic trick if she stops putting fucking spiders everywhere. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, for I someone don't know who's if like, that's a, a good deal. Like a... Well, then you don't get to see a fucking magic trick, do you? Get fucked. I can do my own magic tricks. I don't need you to show me. Yeah, that. but it's a magic trick without magic. That's why it's cool. I have to say, I admire your ability to remain this chaotic in the face of danger. We're Me? not really going to have some sort of breakdown and cry. Mm. I'm just trying to leave some tension. You as in, you as a group. Okay. It's either this or we all cry, so. That's why we get along. Do you? We get along? Okay. Do we? <laughs> well, we're not all dead yet, so. That's true. That yeah. can be arranged if you keep on putting fucking spiders around. Ah, oh, like you could. I just signed a Kess, just make the deal, and next time instead of a spider, just do a scorpion or something. Just change mm. the the creature. But like we did for the fucking... For ass face. Yeah. Oh, yeah. What a fucking name! <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Ass face? That's Mr. Face. <laughs> Please, that my, Mr. Face Please, is my father. My <laughs> call, call me ass. <laughs> Anyway, <laughs> you get guided uh, through the jungle, and about a few hours in, so two, three hours, um, Sirin slows down, starts looking and looking around, and kind of points, mind this tripwire, and steps over it. I will also step the trip over tripwire attached to any it. sense in disarming it? Um... Typically, these these wires are used to make a lot of noise uh, because we're close to the temple uh, village. So it would attract attention. Um, if you're sure that by dismantling it, you won't accidentally ring the uh, ring the bell or whatever it's attached to anyway. Sure. Um, if I'm doing it, I'm not entirely confident that I could do it without making any noise. I, I just if there's no if there's no reason to. Might as well just move on. This means we make a bit of noise when we go away, but I feel like they'll figure it out by that point. True. Yeah, just hoping it was attached to something. Wound us, it might be worth getting out of the use. way on the way back, but no, it doesn't matter. Just fucking cautiously stride over it. Yeah, I'll hop over. All right. And you arrive on the outskirts of Seth Khan. Uh, Sekthar, oh, sorry. Shit. Sekthar, my bad, my bad. Yep. Uh, this, uh, a large a ziggurat at the center, surrounded by circular stone huts. Um, you're kind of in some foliage, in some, in some shrubbery. And you can see a Yuan-Ti standing on top of what seems to be some kind of a pedestal, wearing green and purple robes, addressing a group of at least 100 Yuan-Ti, having a bit of a speech, and Syrian kind of translates, translates it to you, um... As he goes, because I'm pretty sure none of you speak Draconic, right? Mm, nope. No. Nope. We established this whenever we got uh, yeah, fucking we running into it. Yeah, we do. Yeah. Tonight, we shall travel Draconic? through the jungle, destroying everything on our way to the outsider's capital city. I sacrifice as many of them as possible to our master. Have your rest. Keep your eyes out. We're expecting a group of resistant little pests, I'm assuming that's you. No. Jeremiah told us about them. I retire to prepare in the temple. Do not disturb me. And as she kind of finishes translating, you can see Rixal stepping off the pedestal and heading into the ziggurat. And the crowd of over 100 Yuan-Ti kind of scatters throughout the uh, the settlement. Scatter. Looks like they're expecting you. They got a nice welcoming party for us. That's always nice. Ideally, we avoid the welcoming party and managed to get into the ziggurats without them seeing yeah, us. Yeah, the parties we've been to uh, so far of, have been kind of terrible. Waste of a banquet. What do you mean? What do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? The parties we've been to so far have been kind of terrible. Mm. I was at one of those. Mm -hmm. Time and place. <laughs> Let's keep our heads in, in this, alright? <laughs> you've not met these people before, have you? <laughs> I've not. Yeah, you'll get used to it. Right. Make me regret it. <laughs> Fucking ranger duo. 
Figure out which way we're going in, and I'm a little fucking stealth in, I guess. Uh, Siren kind of looks at you, Davian. Hmm. Well, the cigarette's right there. There are some huts along the way that we, that we could use for cover, but... Now is not the time to trip and make noise, I suppose. Oh, Unless so you, you see a better route. Can I smell anything that doesn't smell like you want tea, but smells kind of monstrous or reptilian? Seeing if I can smell the hydra already. Make a perception check. <clears throat> nope. Uh, this dice getting banned. Eleven. <laughs> uh, at this point, all you smell is just the overwhelming presence of Yuan Ti scent. Okay. Um, Fair. Sirin does look at you, Davian, and says, "Say we get seen. I suggest you make a run for the ziggurat, because every ziggurat's." Is a trap mechanism that we can trigger to close the door behind us and it can only be opened from the inside so at least We'd... there's that you've seen that in action so we're going to trap ourselves well yes but my logic is if we're going to fight whatever's down there including the hydra you kind of want to make sure that backup cannot enter right hmm that way we only have to keep an eye on what's in front of us, not behind us. Okay, so how close are we to the, like, village? Uh, about, about 100 feet to, like, the nearest hut. And the layout of the village is, like, sparsely just sort of huts ziggurats, all around? Ziggurats then... in the middle, and then just, like, surrounded by two A rings ring of, 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 of like, rings. round huts. How many... Is it is it busy? Is there like yeah, is there I mean, a yeah, gathering there's of over one hundred yuan ti just kind of scattered throughout the town. Some of which looking at the are perimeter, they just, some are of they which civilian is civilian or are they like uh, a mixture of both? Armed. A mixture of civilians, but also definitely fighters. People that people that came for a fight. We need a distraction. What do you suggest? I have Your no. friend seems. Bit of an illusionist. Maybe she could put that to good use for once. What sort of scale? for once? <laughs> we could start put that for to really. use that benefits all of us, not just yourself. Are okay, the huts all stone? That, I can accept. What was that, dude? Sorry. Are the huts all stone? Yeah. Roof and all. Yes. Is there any hay? No. Oh, I would recommend starting a fire, but, I mean, we're in the middle of a jungle, and nothing they have seems to be too flammable, so mm. I don't know if that is going to be an option. Uh, Illusion, maybe, if we can make something big. I, ha I have a good idea, I think. Do tell. Well, even though she's a dick, I'm assuming, Castlin. Minor illusion? Sound about right? Yes. Although okay. You also don't know my name is Kessler. Fuck. <laughs> yes. Imagine having a full name telling me like a year in advance of the campaign. Oh, and not telling me you. that she had it. I made the nickname. I shortened it to Kess. But Brooks doesn't know that her full name is Kessler. True. Mm -hmm. Welcome to Roll. Wow. Wow. In character, oh. character knowledge, metagaming, back to square one. <laughs> do we need a re? <laughs> do we need to read the re re retelling of the rules? Yeah, I'm, I'm metagaming her full name because <laughs> yeah. I get so much like. <sighs> okay, I'm um, right. So, how good your your mimicry? I mean, do you really need a good mimicry with my illusion? Because you can mimic. I can make any sound. You can I mimic want. someone else's voice, right? Like, I, I mean, yeah. people who cast the spell can mimic other people's voices, right? Yeah. So, if Siren says something in draconic, like mm -hmm. "there's intruders" or in, to the north, you could mimic that down by other people. They'll all fuck off to the north, and we're on whichever side we're on, because I haven't paid that much attention to which side we're on. I mean, they're not all 
you know, no matter what the sound is, I doubt everyone in the camp is going to flock to one side. But all we need, I think, is a gap quick enough for us to get in and trigger this mechanism to lock everybody out and then get down and do whatever we have to do and pray to God we have time to do it. Uh, oh. oh. I sort of have an idea, but I don't know if we, if it, how long it might take. Remember that giant fucking ape? Oh. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What if there's something else within... There was a really big ape. Anyway, what if there's <laughs> something else within a mile? Something big. Something big enough to create some sort of... Mm, calamity. Within a mile? That's very specific. That's just probably about as far as we'd be able to comfortably go, find it. Maybe we could spread out, find something, so we're... lure it here. We're going to go find something, try and lure it here, try and convince it not to attack us, but instead to fuck off oh, down there. Oh, Well, if it attacks us, it attacks us, but we just need to make sure that it doesn't fucking kill us. And then when it gets here, we make ourselves scarce, and I'm sure you on T flock to it. I mean, Do you not think know, that when just... we lead this thing into the, like, the camp, they're going to see us as well as this? Oh my god. Guys, we can recreate Godzilla versus Kong, make the ape fight the Hydra. <laughs> oh. I can talk to more him. like Godzilla vs. It's more can you dearer, but convince it to get itself killed for us? Because I mean no. this in the nicest way possible. You haven't been the most uh, persuasive person to me. I managed. To, I managed to convince two stallions to go buy pepper and caramel, and if that's not convincing, <laughs> nothing. Well, what is their that's option? They true. say no, and instead we dump them off to a fucking glue factory. I mean, we don't need to go. I think that much of the distraction, as you say, right? We just need enough. To I can get, easily get to make it sound like someone is shouting for help, and I can also create the image of someone running in a particular direction to lead them as far away in that. I mean, if in doubt, I can shoot off. We were significant enough to get mentioned in the fucking morning praise be speech. Which means that if <laughs> someone mentions that we're on the other side, of th they're going to at least look the other fucking direction if they all don't just fuck off that way anyway. I think... Yes, I could always it... make it sound like someone is saying they're here. But at I whichever side language. of the temple we're not. Yeah, well, yeah, we asked Siren to translate it. She can listen to it and fucking mimic it with <laughs> illusion magic. Ta fucking da, we're brilliant. I still feel like we're lacking any sort of scale, though, in this sense. I mean, just there's like, enough oh, fucking oh, scales down an there. Opening. It's a colony of snake people. We don't, need, we don't need half the fucking village to go over. We just need enough so we can get so in, can get, get in. close that temple off. I feel like that's the best plan. I don't think it, there's any sneaking um, in properly. Yet. No, but if I... we're on high alert and we want a distraction over here, we we need a distraction that moves the ones on our side, which is not going to happen. Yeah, yeah no, I can make it sound we, like we it's have... coming from here. And I can make it no, sound no, no, like no. it's coming from 30 foot that way. If you, if you from 30 foot away, the... make it sound like someone is repeating a message that there's intrusion on the other side, then they're going to move over to the other side, thinking that, you know. Dutch. Hmm. Remember when we talked about exactly this on this course? <laughs> everyone being stupid no everyone just over planning like, like the yeah. planning is so mm -hmm. much that at some point you get to the point of yeah you have a plan for everything and i know for a fact it's just gonna go to shit the second you start to actually why don't do we it. just try it and see what happens and if it doesn't work then yeah. at the end of the day we're you know we're, we've not I... wasted any serious they're to get ready to run i suppose is the best <clears throat> knowledge stretch remember to stretch stretching is important limber up Cheers. I can sign to cast stretching. Some help stretching, Elastra. No more, thank you. I'll sign to cast if they do see through the the illusion and they notice us. I'm pretty fast. I could pull them away, and I'm sure I'd outrun them and could make it back to you guys. Dagon is saying that she could always lead them in a particular direction and outrun them to get back to us. Well, quite that is true. She's very fucking fast. If you're so that's so, plan B. If Daigon's so fast, she can lure a great beast here to keep them busy. Oh, we're not going to lure a bloody great beast. There won't the be odds are of a great be beast being in a mile radius is pretty fucking unlikely. What are the odds of a great beast being within a mile radius? 
Pretty unlikely. Not, I'm not uh, asking you. I'm I'll asking start. the one who lives I, here. I'll, I'll, I'll sign to Kess to tell uh, Davian, generally, this many like living beings gathered in one place tends to deter even larger predators because they're outnumbered. I'll repeat that. Exactly. We weren't far from home when we ran across a flock. We were uh, a murder. We were of a third bit away. We were, like, we were like nearly a half day's travel. We were into the in jungle. the jungle, proper jungle, not near Eldalon. Yeah, we were like in the middle of the jungle. No one goes we in. We were the all jungle. in the jungle's business. I never say it like that again. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Why don't we just try it and see what happens? There's two rings of huts. I'm correct. Very much struggling with sitting planning for this long. Do you need a fidget cube? No, I need <laughs> us to do something. Let's just try it and see what happens. Let's just make a small distraction. We go hut to hut. We go. If it goes tits up, then I'll, I'll even let you say I told you so. Yeah. You get those bragging rights, Davian. They did say they plan to start marching tonight. I would like to get in that cigarette before that happens. Yes. Yeah. All that. What do you think, Siren? Do you think an illusion like this might, you know, just just the, the talk of people being on the other side of the temple might get people to at least fucking go that way out of curiosity? It would cause a distraction. It would allow a small window. And at the end of the day, even if we get seen, it doesn't matter that much as long as we get into the temple before they catch up to us. Once we're inside, activate the mechanism, door closes. Mm -hmm. yeah. Perfect. Right then. Do, you, does, do any of you have any tools or supplies that are both threatening but also loud, perhaps? No. No. <laughs> Threatening uh, and loud. Like fireworks or firecrackers uh, or something. Yeah. yeah. Explosives, fire, anything. God, no. Jax might if you give me give me a moment. To check Go through his pack treat. while he start while he stands here. <laughs> oblivious like he's dead inside. I don't think Jax is anything. Mm, no, he doesn't. No. Um, but he still um, has the brood guard heads. <laughs> yeah, he does. That Might shit's have fucking stanky. It's not well. It's not loud. It's not particularly yeah, but in his back. It, it might, won't be, will it? It might be a sufficient distraction. Although I would hate to be at a loss for them. At, what three days after I bought them? What? I could fire a couple of smoke clouds, maybe on somewhere in the camp. It could really work. feel like those are worth saving. I mean, what are we saving for, saving them for other than a time like this? The way out, maybe? I've got five of them. How if much Kets, area do they if, cover? If, if Kets, oh, uh, that would have to, you'd have to ask the big man in the sky. Uh, if Kets oh. <laughs> makes some Dear sort Lord, of traction, how How much area does a smoke bomb arrow cover? Uh, maybe uh, Syrian the smoke and I arrows. Both. Yeah. <clears throat> um, ten foot sphere. Thank you, Aros. <laughs> Syrian and I both. Radius or diameter? Uh, it just says ten foot sphere, so I'm assuming. Probably diameter. Well, I'm yeah. assuming diameter. diameter. Okay. Yeah. How many meters did you say it was from here to the? Temple? You're 100 feet away from the initial like line of huts. Then the the second line of huts is another 60 feet, and the ziggurats is another 60 feet. So a little over 200 feet. Yes, great. It's an illusion, say, what, 30 feet from us or something. Mm -hmm. Sir and I both loose a smoke cloud somewhere in roughly in the same area. Then you've got there's a lot going on. You're probably going to draw out, you know, a few five, six of the perimeter guards at least to go and investigate. Then that's yeah, I just to dart in. I'm just worried what about if, having if, something that draws attention to thirty many, feet how away many from times us. Times could you create an illusion like this? As many as I want. How about 
one on each side, one smoke arrow on each side, causing the people to split. That would work. That way, instead of the one group going to check out, say, the right side of camp, there's also going to have to be people to check out the other side of camp, and we just... You can, you can only create the illusion within 30 feet? Yes. So... We would have to lay very low. Yeah, that's that's my worry. That's why I sort of want to do something vocal that directs their attention not to the origin of the sound, but what the sound's directing them to, if that makes sense. Like, if if, if she says, look over here in Draconic, they're looking 30, 30 feet away from us, but if she says, look over there... What if I yell, might... they're flanking us? Or like, death from the shadows... Or from a direct, from a compass direction. I, well, that's side, what I said originally. Or... Well, I we, have we... the ability to cast a spell, which is pretty loud, but it, I can only cast it. You know, it, it's not like um, something I can cast far away. It only has a five foot range. Where? Okay. Which the side of the temple? The sound will be heard up to hundred feet away. But it which side of the temple? It would involve me being at the point at the point where you want the distraction to be, and I don't feel very confident. That is the smart well, play. That's why we I would very much not like to have you as some sort of fucking bait, because you're basically our way out of I, here. I assume they recognize you. I assume you're not like they won't... Right? Not, well, not I am part of the tribe that uh, decided to not ally with them in their evil I assume you have a... Uh, I'm not up on Yuanti culture. Are you distinctly like? Does she look distinctly different to other Yuanti in the sense of like? In the same way as you know, tribe, you know who your neighbor are. is, and you know, yeah, you know what oh, right, I mean? like, yeah. It's that, like, if people yeah. in this town know her, no. they'll know her. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Wow. That's, 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 that's she has this clothes that she has spent time in this town, so it's a safe right. bet that it's, it's, it's people. A good chunk they of the people all look the her. same. <laughs> it's like that one guy that you met at a yeah. birthday party a couple of times. It turns like, out to be like a, an on the run murderer, and you're like, if you see him in the supermarket, you're gonna know <laughs> that he's an on the run murderer. You're gonna what recognize it. Right, okay, why don't we just fucking kill a couple? Why don't, don't we just try the fucking. Which side of the temple are we on right now? Uh, you're approaching from the south. Where you, you went northeast, so you're approaching from the southwest. Right. Directions. Yes. Why don't you fucking. Why don't we all go up to the, the as close as we can get without getting spotted? Syrian says they're, they're, are pro, they're on the fucking. We're approaching. We're approaching from the southwest. The southwest. Yep. So we we Obviously. use illusion magic to say some shit like they're coming from the northeast, and then we see if they fuck off to look at the northeast, and if not, we haven't lost anything. Do. Do jungle Yuan-Ti tribes use the cardinal directions? Yes. Right. So uh, they're not fucking good. barbarians. Some of, us. I assume. Some, some, some of us are. These are fucking cultures that have not encountered anyone from the lands that we come from in a very long time. Well, I assume that cardinal directions are pretty fucking cardinal. And, you know... Right, yeah, I'm on... Know. They use them in the Feywild. People well. from the Empire and people from the Kingdoms, but... Also people well, there you go. from Agrand. There you go. Well, there's been a massive fucking storm in the way for however fucking long, so who knows if they made it this far yet. Well, how would they know which direction the storm went if they didn't know directions? The storm kind of just subsided completely all at the same time. While, while they're having that conversation, I just roll my eyes and I sign to Kess. I give them five more minutes before I just try and sneak in myself. I'm bored. <laughs> I... Can I see right. those two signing? And I'm just like... Mm -hmm. <laughs> Alright, okay. Ugh. Okay. Uh, 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 let's wait. just try the illusion. See what uh, happens. Hold on, Brooks. No, I do like that idea because it means I can fucking shoot an arrow probably over the camp that no one would see, land a smoke cloud to the northeast. We oh, they, uh, they you fucking like that idea, off. do you? Well, grand, because uh, that uh, was uh, the fucking uh, idea I had first. That's what I just said. Chanting, Brooks. So why did we... Ah! <sighs> Brooks, calm it down. You're gonna let them. Fuck's sake, man. Wait, you are agreeing with each other yet you're upset? This is why I'm upset. This is the first idea I had. This we could be in. The only problem that I have with it is someone will need to go around. 
Why? What, what do you mean where? Because you can only cast the illusion within 30 feet. How I'm casting fine. on 30 feet to the people in front of us that we want to move, and no. we tell them that there's We're shit on the other side, and they fuck off to look at but it. The okay, the people in front of us hear a voice say they're coming from the northeast. They're, they're going to look around and be like, "What? where did this disembodied voice come from? Well, that's why I said let's I can e try it. And then I can easily go within the range that we need. I, I think that's a better idea for me to move further away from you than just 30 feet. I suppose. While they're having that, can I check just quickly to see if it looks like any of them are hearing as Brooks is getting louder and louder? Can I just check to see no, if it looks still, like you're still 100 feet away from the Brooks is from the initial very okay. much line of height, so. struggling to sit still at this point. Okay, just show me. All right, so how about just I fire the arrows? Off. Let's just fire some arrows. Yep, I passed her a smoke arrow. She takes it and gets it ready in her bow to the northeast, and we'll see what happens. Sounds perfect to me. I'm Jeez. gonna start slinking forward, stealth yeah. mode. I'm gonna cast my drama. And she kind of looks at you, Davian, and, uh, and kind of like counts you down. And on 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 zero, she lets her arrow fly. I'm trying to figure out what the what's the range of lumber, like 300 feet or something. Range. Something like that, yeah. It's like one. So you'll definitely be able to. <laughs> oh, there you go. So you'll be able. Yeah, you both like you you reach the other side of the of the, of the village easily. Arrows mm. land, and Im immediately you hear shouting coming from that side, uh, movements in the village. Let me see if the initial group on your side does anything. Huh! Yes, they do. They're stupid, and they're also... Which creates an opportunity for you to uh, at least get to the first line of huts. All right. Go, go, go. I would like for you all, for, for the sake of this, uh, I would like for you all to roll a stealth check, though. Alright, new dice this time. New better. Oh, oh, what you die? Because I, cool. I rolled a 19 minus 2, so 17. So much better. 16. Okay. So? 16. 16. Uh, 23. 28. 21. 28, Jesus. Alright, lowest was Sirin with a with a 15, I believe. So I think uh, we're, we're good. Yeah. So you make it to the initial line of huts. The group of guards that was positioned there have moved to the northeast. You see, as far as you can tell, you see a clear line to just beeline it to, to the ziggurat, which Sirian also makes you aware of. I'm gonna start running. Let's just keep going. going. Yeah. Yeah. Sirian, just, Sirian just stops the sneaking and just starts sprinting. Yeah, yeah. She's, mm -hmm. she's going. Oh, we're breaking I... out in a spin? Yeah, in yeah. a spin. I... We're breaking out in a spin. Let's go. I'm gonna use my feline agility to double my movement speed, so I'm. Gone. Yeah, you. Oh, she's overtake, just gone. You overtake. Sirin. Aladdin doesn't run. <laughs> so we're doing what? Well, we're doing, off, off, we're doing off, sixty off. foot a turn. Yeah. She's doing a hundred and sixty. Uh, right now, so. I'm just doing eighty because I didn't use step of the wind. I just used the feline agility. No, but agility. We're, we're dashing. Yeah, but you are dashing. Oh, we're dashing. Then yeah, yeah. I'm so you're doing one hundred and sixty. So you make it so to each you, turn. You make it to the ground within six seconds, Laura. Fuck yeah, dude. <laughs> Closely followed. You all, you all kind of enter the ziggurat, and Sirin, oh. as soon as you're all uh, entered. Yeah? When I get there, since I'm ahead of the group, I know it's only by a few seconds, can I start looking for whatever mechanism Sirin described to bring uh, it down sure, in case by we the need time, it? Sure, but by the time you're oh, all okay. in, Sirin automatically like, goes to, uh, oh, goes okay. to uh, a small like fucking uh, a small gap in the wall and, and, and flicks, flicks a switch down, and the temple door raises out of the ground behind you and closes. Okay. Fucking lords outside. Fucking finds it straight away. Just closes it out. Yeah, imagine. <laughs> Minor illusion of voice just going suckers on the other side of the door. We have had a treaty for years. We made it in. Yeah, perfect. That was the easy part. That was the easy part. Bloody hell. Give me. Oh, me. Well, obviously. Fight. As as we get in and mm -hmm. the doors close behind us, I I want to rack my brains for anything that seems familiar. Make a history check. Oh, how dark is that? I want to rack his brains as well. Uh, There's torches lighting um, up the, the area. And can I make another? Me. Can I make another smell check in the air? See if I can smell yeah. the hydra yet. Now that we're inside and isolated a bit from the Yuanti. You can. Smell check. Thirteen. Smell check. Thirteen. You recognize his room, Davian. Fuck. And you see that on the other side of this room, there is a doorway that leads into a tunnel. <laughs> You, so far, you recognize it. So far, you, you recognize where you are. I will take Snake, man. one of the lit torches, mm -hmm. I guess, that's in one of the sconces. Yeah. And I will just 
wordlessly slowly make for that door. What did you roll, Laura, for your perception? Seven. Not really. Seven. No, wait, eight. Nope. Nah. <laughs> Um, burn all those smells out. Like, I was just thinking of moving. I'm like, is that the correct way to go, Devin? Are you sure? Um, I, yeah, this looks right. Uh, I trust our ranger man, even if he's a bit of an idiot. If those who want to see better come closer. I feel so, more so like an explorer with a torch. Is this the thing I mean, where I you, you make us see better? Like, more? Uh, yeah, mm. if you want it. Um, can you do it to... So, well, I, I can already see in the dark, but not as good as... How, who can't showing. see in the dark? Uh, how many people can you get with it? Brooks Four. can't either, right? Oh, Four. I bet he can, because he has some weird characters. What about Jax? Them, can Jax see in the I, dark? I'll, uh, Jax can't see in the dark, yeah, I believe. So Jax, Devin, definitely. Uh, do, 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 do. Uh, he doesn't appear to have dark vision, no. Yeah. Yeah. So I'll give it to Siren as well, so one more, whoever wants it. One more. Who else can't I'll, see in the dark? I'll, I mean, I can see in the dark, but because I can move so fast, if no one else wants it, I'll volunteer to take it. Because if I can see further, and I can, I can as well. So I don't know what point we're gonna have a stretch longer than sixty feet in a in a labyrinth. <laughs> but... We don't know. I mean, we don't know. It's just nice to have. It's just a, last yeah. hour. Fuck it. Might as well do it. And then I will also ooh, uh, give Kess a vigilant blessing. Ooh. I don't need to see what to punch things, just you get an punch. initiative. On initiative? Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> Alright. And this time, taking the lead from our reptilian friend. Yeah, I'll, I'll make a start down the tunnel. Okay. Yep. As you um, walk down the tunnels, you recognize the path you know what path to take for some reason that that dream you had has kind of imprinted almost like like a blueprint of this labyrinth in your brain and you know exactly what path to take and exactly what 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 turns to bend and you're not sure how to explain it i want to i want to try and play it off as we're going every okay. sort of junction we come to every corner that looks a little like i just want to like look like I'm thinking about it and like checking and then continuing on just, to just quick... following my gut can I... question. in in um when Davian talked to um me did mm -hmm. he mention the content or just this stream is after we had a conversation Okay, never mind then. <laughs> okay, uh, can I can I uh, tell he's faking it, even if it's just I mean, like, then, passive then, insight? I was like, then my next wish is I'm gonna um, fucking insight. I mean, if if Davian is actively trying to make it seem it. like he uh, yeah, I'm trying to play it off because I don't want a, it to look. Like I would know. this be? I would say make this a performance check because you're acting. Oh, performance, way, okay. Right? Yeah. Oh my god, I thought I had a plus five for a second. <laughs> you're like, I, I got this. Shit, man. Oh, What's your passive okay. insights? Hey, Dan, uh, got this. My passive insight is sixteen. Also sixteen. Also sixteen higher than nine. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is. Um, Kess, you get the sense that um, the way he the Davian is trying to make it seem like he's thinking about it. Uh, you get the sense that that is fake. Whether that means that he's just guessing but making it seem like he knows what he's doing, or he knows the way and is trying to make it seem that he is actually working for it, you don't know. Okay. Oh, I like that. I hadn't even considered that. Just, I does Cass assume like that he's lying or an idiot? <laughs> yeah, exactly. You know that yeah. the, it's a performance that he's trying to make it look like he's making educated decisions, but whether Either that means whether he's faking it because he doesn't know what he's doing or he's faking it because he does know, you're not sure. Okay. I'm not. Um, but... I'm not looking for traps this entire time. By the way, so I'm just okay. Good to know. I'm um, just a shoot. If I notice that he's not, then I'll start keeping an eye out for traps, even though I'm not any good at it. Okay. Uh, just make me a perception check, uh, Ethan. Natural twenty, <laughs> but only it a twenty-one. Seems that this tunnel has has little to no traps. Uh, there's one okay. where you see like before Davian crosses the path, you kind of like shout out that there is a trap. 
like not shouting as in, but loud enough for Davian to can I choose not, not to, stop. to say anything? Uh, yes, you can if you want to. I mean, Davian's leading. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> sure. I'm what just gonna wait until he gets super close me? to it. No, what no, 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 no. Hurt everybody. No, 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 no. Hear me out. Uh -huh. As he's getting closer to it, mm -hmm. does it look like he's gonna step on it? Or does it look like he knows yeah, he's that not it's looking, there? So yes. He's not looking at all. Not for traps, no. I he, he just said it. Fix it on the direction yeah. we are heading. I am not looking for traps actively. Dav. Mm. You're not. Hmm? You can look in front of you. Well, what is it? What do I see? As uh, as Brooks kind of just lets like you know to uh, keep your eyes open, open yeah. you see that there is a pressure plate on the floor uh, in front of you, like a couple of steps in front of you. Come on, man. I'm fucking garbage at this shit, and even I saw that. Just kind of go around it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Watch out! Watch out! Doing all right. I'm. I'm just. I mean, I'm f just focused. Mm. That's not. I'm, I'm like you. Like you. Element. <laughs> well, I mean, the sense of direction is one thing. I just can't do two things at once. I mean, I'm glad you caught that because. Is anyone I'm not paying too much that... attention to the floor? Right? There's, you know, like, war the, markings and stronger. Or... Is anyone good at checking for traps? Because. I'm fucking not. I'm, I'm good. Just I'm looking. okay at it. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll call over to Daigon. And um, is the smell getting stronger, or are we getting closer, or are we being led astray? Daigon, <laughs> Laura. <laughs> what? Oh my. No. He was allows when I spoke. Do you, you smell any lady. Hydra? Oh, sorry. Uh, I was checking something. To say I was that she has fucking. In my notes. I was looking yeah, for to say that she has feline hearing. This bitch <laughs> deaf as hell. All right, <laughs> I, I don't. I have to do another perception check, I guess. To see yes. If I smell it. Please. Uh, twenty-one this time. Oh yeah. Uh, oh, just you not smell yes. Smell a smelly smell of something that smells very smelly in the direction of <laughs> which you are headed. Okay, I just like point straight ahead and gesture like this, like done, sm and like wrinkle my nose, like it done smell good. Anyone there? Uh... Oh, wow, Davin looks like you got a great sense of direction. Not that I doubt you. Mm. Uh, there's yes. more hydras. on each of these. I, I, you know. Does anyone know anything about hydras? Do I know um, anything? About... I know um, they're bad. Lots of heads. Oh, yeah, no shit. That, that, yeah, lots, no. Lots of heads. Something about. Them going back. I'm not sure if that's myth or actual fact, though. No, I, I, I understand that a Hydra has many heads. It's sort of a <laughs> defining characteristic. I meant, does anyone know anything that like we need to know before we get fucking do, Eden? Do, do I know anything we need to know? I'm, I'm yeah, like, Benjamin. Um, make a... make a nature check. <laughs> I mean, like, heard the name. I know that Hydra has lots of heads. My, my younger. My older brother read books on it when we were younger, but... <laughs> we all were like, where are you going with this for a minute? Yeah. My younger brother was a Hydra. <laughs> yeah, we were like... No, when, when I was younger, my older brother read well, the books about it. Was it was a Hydra? Was <laughs> 13. 13? My Hail Hydra. You know that an interesting fact about Hydras is, while the creature is asleep, at least one of its heads is awake. Oh, I hate that. That doesn't help oh, it. It's I never always, always asleep. Um, you also know that... Um, the more heads mean? it has, the more opportunities for reactions it has. Ooh. Um, this is gonna be great. That's about it. All I can tell you is the more heads it has, the worse. So, so basically, we're we're fucked. Well, we don't know how many heads this one has. It might have one. Then it wouldn't be a hydro, would it? Well, I don't know. A Hydra only had really. one head. No, it's true, I suppose. If a, if a Hydra had, say, two heads, wouldn't it just bite off its own head to grow more heads? That is interesting. That's a terrifying that concept could, that, 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 that I didn't would, need you putting into the mind of the gods. That would work, you know. 
don't for each head it have... loses, it regains two. So in theory, I don't think that would it work. Has, uh, intrinsic knowledge on how that works. I think it's more natural instinct than uh, you know. Uh, I'm, I'm going just to gonna. Think it's more just kind of happens rather like than when a lizard drops its tail. Yeah, yeah kind yeah, of. Yeah, but they drop its tail to get away and then grow another yeah. one back. Yeah, right? but it's. So yeah, it but I don't think it's a conscious to choice. I think it's a stress reaction. While they're saying that, I'm just going to sign to Kess, monster's a monster, bleeds enough, it'll die. Go for the heart, not the head. That's what I'm getting from this. It's pretty fucking metal. <laughs> Go, Go for the, for the heart, heart, not the head. <laughs> monster's a monster, if it bleeds, it'll right. die. So as you kind of move past the pressure plates pointed out by Brooks, um, eventually you find yourselves entering or reaching a chamber. A very large chamber. A secret chamber? Covered with uh, about like ankle high water, the, the entire floor. On the opposite end of the chamber, you see a stone table behind which stands the same priest that stood outside. Beside him yes. is Yuan T. Abomination. Do you recognize the creature that Jeremiah got turned into? You. What do you do? They have they seen us? I mean, uh, pretty impossible to enter a room full of water without making. Uh, well, you're, you're, this, you're not you're not in the room yet. You just see like yeah. a little st stairway down that leads into a room. Thank uh, high water. I could, I could try putting him to sleep. It's how far away well, you have past? I mean, ninety feet. Let me quickly quickly fact check this. Uh, hold on. So you're right here. Twenty feet point. 20, does the water? 30, 30, 30, 40, does the water 45, look? Hold 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 hold. Sorry. Forty five. Sorry. Sixty. Sixty five. Seventy. Seventy. They're out of little... range here. They're out of range of ninety feet. You have to enter the chamber well, properly. Well, it's ninety feet and then twenty feet of the ninety feet. So technically, it could be a hundred and ten. Just Christ. about then. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. The water. I know you might we might not be able to tell from our distance. Does it look? deep like is it like black or dark color or can we see floor beneath it is yeah it clear it's, enough it's, to it's see about the ankle height oh okay okay it's chill i mean i can i can try there's I no waste up my trousers there's no guarantee of success. yes if i see other people i'm like yep yeah. oh these fucking there's no guarantee of success issues. there's no guarantee of success but i could try it if it fails will they know that you've tried it does it give us like, does it uh, the element of surprise? I, I mean, element of surprise as, as soon as we step in that water. There's, there's as far as really I'm aware, they, they wouldn't know that. They would know are if they, you, when they are. Are you confident enough in your abilities to put them both to sleep? Or is that initial surprise going to be more worthwhile trying to nuke the fuckers? <laughs> well, one of them might fall asleep and they might look around. But they'll be asleep. And then we can nuke in if I... I'm successful, but as far as I'm aware, they But if you're old. not successful, would it? I don't believe so. I mean, Davian reckons that the moment we're in the room, they know we're there, right? Hmm. Yeah. So, it's quite hard to be silent in water. So are we better just walking straight in, like throwing everything we have at them, than going for sleepy, sleepy night, night, or? Because you have to be in the room to do it, right? I kind of look at the distance, and I might just be able to get them. If I get right on the edge of the room, just before the water. So it's it's Jeremiah as Abomination Yuanti, and what else in the room again? The priest is all the hydra so far. And the priest? The oh, you, we don't just see the, you don't see the hydra. Do I smell it? Yes. You smell okay. something that is not Yuanti in that room. Okay. Priest. Fucking, uh, I'm gonna... Riskel? Yeah, I'm gonna sign to Kess and, and ask her to tell the group. You assume so. I can yeah. I can smell it. It's definitely here. Might be invisible. That's um, fucking. Dagon says that the Hydra is definitely around here somewhere. Uh, it might, might be invisible. Be in a, might be an additional chamber, maybe that we can't see. Maybe. Right. Can Hydras breathe underwater? The water's ankle what deep. If, what if it's not um, ankle here deep in the middle? Uh. What if we get in and it's like I that one God. water temple level that everyone hates at their their <laughs> local carnival game? I've never, I've never played that one. You've never played a carnival? Every carnival game you play has a water level and everyone hates it. Like the duck hooking game? I fucking hate that one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, mean, I could try, it's up to you guys. 
I, I'm... The one about the blue tabaxi as well, that has an awful water level. No I'm reaction. this close to just having the ceiling collapse on top of you, Ethan. Oh, <laughs> I think you try put them to sleep. Right. But let's get ready. Maybe I think maybe we like shoot can you put, them. Can, can you put both of them to sleep, or is it better to have you focus on one and have us try and kill it's the other? Kind of, it affects an area, and whichever one. Is... How do I put this? It's. It affects the whichever area. Whichever one of them's weaker. Yeah, whichever like... one's weaker or at least uh, less hearty uh, goes to sleep. And then if the other one is also less hearty, they go to sleep as well. Um, oh. It's how it affects. It seems a bit random. Realistically. I could get one, th probably. The priest, probably, right? Like, we, we all assume that I don't get much the horrible fucking Eldritch monster it. is... No, but we all assume that the Eldritch monster is a bit more, uh... Party? Maybe. We don't know how... Constitutional. Yes, I suppose. I mean, I could maybe try and... Is, can I possibly aim it to just affect the priest? Wait, wait Dutch. No. How, uh, no. how, how far are they? Like 100 feet, right? Let me check again. Um... You're on the edge of the room here. 100. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 55, uh, 80, 75. 105, 110. Oh, dude, no, they're, they're over 110, so I don't think. No, 110? Yeah. So, yeah. But Never if mind. you targeted a point, I can do 100. Next range on sleep. Huh? If, you do, if you can do 100, yeah. what's, the, what's the radius on it? The radius, so it's 90 feet range and then 20 yeah. feet radius. So we could do 90 here. foot and it would reach 110 foot. Yeah, yeah which no, will just head. get which will just get uh, the abomination, the snake man. Of course it would. Because uh, the priest is behind the table that you see. Um, but do we... I mean, we just I fire in. I mean, realistically, if we think that one of them is going to be awake anyway, do we not just walk in, start shooting the fuckers, then try and make one of them sleepy, sleepy night night? Sounds good. Run in, gun, run in shoot a bunch, gun in. So we all we all go in. You hold your sleep oh. until we've. Well, I can use a spell, anyways, and then next, and then. Okay, I mean, yeah, that works yeah. as well. Yeah. I just thought it might be worth like having us all throw what we can sleep. at the abomination, then have you cast sleep it after we're all yeah. done. I mean, again, doesn't make much difference. I can help with damaging, and then just right. Although I will be I do, throwing just... a hand axe until we get up close. So. I mean. You, I've seen you throw hand axes before. You're you're pretty good. They're not yes. the most damaging thing in the world. Or, actually, I'm a fucking genius. That's no, it's the same fucking range as my darts. Oh, I'll suck my taint. <laughs> I've got a fucking I've I've got That's darts, not. but they're fucking the same range as a hand axe. Yeah. It's a fucking point in carrying a dart around if I can't throw it. Any further than I can throw yeah, a hand axe. Like my my spear and my darts are the same range. Like that seems weird. That seems silly. You think it's, you're telling me that someone's thirty foot away, I'm less likely to hit him with a dart than I am at twenty foot. The fuck is this? <sighs> anyway, rules be rules. So these darts are made by a wanker. So I suggest that we uh run in. Mm -hmm. What we got? Maybe they might even wake in a hydro. It wouldn't be great, but at least get all the options out in, in one. Does anyone have any way of getting me over there quicker? Nope. Fuck no. Oh, shit. Is that so good to you, Dan? Um, I, I, I gesture to, like, my back and make, like, like pose as if, like, piggybacking. And... I... don't necessarily know how strong you are. Dagan, I don't know whether you could move at full speed while carrying me as well. I signed a Kess. Even me at half speed is faster than most of you. She says that even at half speed, she's faster than most of us. But is that going to be more... really carry that quickly is you, though, Kess. But is it is it more valuable then to not just have you up there ready to kick seven shades of shit out of him? I just shrug my shoulders. I'm just going to yeah. raise, raise a question for the for the DM. Hello. <laughs> did, did you... Do we have the sprint action? Is that a thing that we that use? Dash. You dash. You dash. 
No, not not dash, but sprint is a homebrew. It's where you use your entire turn, which includes like movement action, bonus action, reaction, to move further than with a dash. No. Okay. Because <laughs> that was it was in one of the like homebrew rule things that I brought up before we started. We do not. Okay. I'm perf- look. I'm perfectly happy right here. I, I can. Why don't I, I can cast Hunter's Mark from ninety feet and I can shoot. That's all that matters. Okay. Well, it's gonna it's gonna take me. Ah, uh, fuck. It it's gonna take me a couple of turns to get up there. So it might be worth just um, everyone doing. It's gonna take it's gonna take me roughly twelve seconds to get up there. That's very precise. Wow. So, is the ankle deep water counted as difficult terrain? No. Good. Thank fuck for that. That'd be a fucking joke. It just <laughs> makes it cinematic as fuck. Exactly. Mm. It just means that I'm gonna ruin <laughs> these shoes. Um, make it so that stealthing is a little harder. Yeah, because you splish splash. Yeesh. I was taking, taking a bath. <laughs> right. I I I I think we just try going guns blazing. Blah, 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 blah. I mean, mm. I don't know what a gun is or. Would we just go in, <laughs> bow's knocked. Amazing. As he says that, I just crack my knuckles. Right then. Siren readies her bow and gets an arrow I, knocked and ready. I, I do sympathize with you, Brooks, but I mean, th there's no plan that's going to get all of us perfectly within range to do as much damage as no, we can. No, 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 no. I just mean that it might be worth holding off on sleep until me and Diagon have had a chance to, you know, put a good fucking smackdown on. Mm -hmm. Makes sense. I agree. If you said that it I works better yeah. when they're wounded, then we're. Oh yeah. You know. yeah, yeah. I can. I, I can do something else. Okay. Perfect. Then that's the plan. The backup plan. All right. I. Well, so are we going? We're going. As you knock an arrow. Uh, fucking going. As you all go in. <laughs> as soon as the last of you enters the room. Of course. Yep. The door closes. And we all go. Your exits. It's actually on the other side of the door. <laughs> to which 120 feet from you, but still uh, loud, loud as ever. In common this time. Oh, good. Quite brave of you. Wander into a snake's nest. Can I just shoot him? You can, absolutely. Yeah, I'm trying to monologue. Can oh, I, I just shoot him? him? Yeah, I mean, while yeah, I mean, he's monologuing, like he'll. he'll I just wanted get to cut be off. running. Like when we were yeah, walking, running. I wanted to run, like feline agility. 20, 22 to hit. 22 to hit. Oh, that hits. Yep. I'm gonna use favorite oh, I'm I'm sprinting as well. I just want to hit okay. Dutch's monologue. I can listen while I run. I'm listening. I'm just like yeah, I don't give no, a shit. That's I'm what just I mean. going. <laughs> that's fine. But yeah, I'm gonna use the charge of favorite foe. Mm -hmm. Oh god. Ten points of piercing damage. Okay. As no. you do that, yes. he like the arrow kind of strikes him in the shoulder blade, and uh, he just looks at you. Our pet is hungry. And from this like dugout ca cave in the side of the room emerges this five-headed, bright oh, yellow wow. eyed Hydra, ran. green and yellow scales, and it just <laughs> thrashes and kind of like cuts you off in the middle of the room and just makes himself wide. And that's where we're gonna take a break. Oh uh, no! Oh, yeah. So 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 me and Daigon running forward just get fucking rugby tackled by a Hydra. Well, uh, potentially we'll quickly, quickly we'll with, with, without showing stream. Hydra emerges and immediately moves itself here. Oh, okay. I did. I, so... I feel like I've definitely set okay. up already. So Same. I'm, I would have been the I say that. I mean, shit. I would gone what's, your, what's, your, what's your movement speed? When you dash? Uh, me? I mean, dash sixty feet. I'm not saying this for an so advantage. You'll, you'll, like, you'll, I don't want to be, like, be near you'll it. Be like here, Daigon. If you're using your full feline bullshit, you'll be like, you'll be, you'll be like. Yeah, and what's your, my what's your, plan what's your, was what's your, to what's use. Your what's your movement on that? If you did the full my... feline shit. My plan was to use uh, Step of the Wind as was a key point, and so my dash becomes a bonus action, uh -huh. and then Feline Agility is not an action or a bonus action, it's just a special okay. trait. I'll, okay, so what is, so it's it, 160. What is 160 feet. Yeah. <laughs> 160 so feet and she's still action, So you'll, move, you'll be moving 80 feet, which will get you, like, here. Yeah. Or uh, just past it. And then the high jump. Do you still choose to use your bonus action to continue ahead, or do you... Yes. Oh. Okay, so you're going to be able to... Where do you want to go? Oh, he's oh, no. oh no. I want to get Priestman, because I think he's in charge, and maybe if he okay. dies, something will happen. The rest of you... Is this where Dutch tells us it takes attack of opportunities? We're just kind of here. And that's where we're going to leave it, so that the map is correct. How many heads? We... 
Five. 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 Oh, oh, oh five my God. So, God. this is just to get the map five in order so that we can immediately get into it after the break. We're going to take a break now, guys. I just that yeah. I forgot to make a Siren token, so I'll do it in the break real quick and put Siren on the map nice. as well. Is there um, already banging on that playlist? Uh, be back in five to yeah, ten maybe. minutes, and we're going to fight a fucking Hydra, boys, among other things. <laughs> Excited. <laughs> Uh, Mr. Jonesy, I hate you so thanks much. for the follow. Appreciate you. Welcome to the welcome oh, to the, the Dungeon Select fam. Yay! And um, did you say Mr. Jonesy? Yeah. If that's from the if, the, if that's in in honor of the cat from Alien, then that's kind of a that's kind of a pog champ for me, bro. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Be over, you guys. I'm get some if you're around here, hit the follow to button. D and D every Sunday, among other things that we do throughout the week. Among us, every no. Wednesday. No. Among us, Wednesdays. No. No, that's not true. <laughs> Can you imagine? I mean, I.
Your brain was Hello? like, oh, bet you better get something to pick that up. Uldra has Yodra on his wall. Because <laughs> he's so Yogurt. smart. Yogurt, right. Yogurt. I have brownie m and <laughs> Dude, I tried those last week. Look at the pog. Yes, so I was good. looking. Yeah. I can't get them anywhere. And if I try and get them on Amazon, I can only buy a box of 24 packs for $54. I'm like, what if I don't they're need that money good, M&Ms? Man. They're, they're solid. I, I like this them. might be oh, a really oh. heavy. You know, the texture is so Moorish to me. <clears throat> what do you mean? It's so much more like. They've got that like cakey texture rather than yeah. just like a chocolate crunch. And mm -hmm. it's just, I just can't stop eating them. Yeah, it's I, so had that, that, I had a bag and it disappeared in like a half an hour. The bag was oh, gone. Oh god, the um, chocolate fucking everywhere! So, quick little <laughs> announcement, guys. As the bot dispute out, I just got the email. You can now listen to Dungeon Select on Spotify and Pocket Casts. Yay! Oh! So, uh, well, right well, now only episode one is up, but uh, soon, hopefully, it'll be caught up with, uh, with all of the stuff. Right, Duke? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so uh, while soon we'll be ca caught up with the uh, YouTube God, and all that. While Koiba's clearing up his shit, I also have an announcement from before. So oh. Johnny, Johnny bought me that one shot and emailed oh. it to me. Aww. So guess go. what, guys? Y'all have been know, playing. Hmm? The cadence or did you say Johnny? Johnny. Ev no, it's, it's always like Johnny. Every single time, my brain goes Johnny's like a melody. <laughs> 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 right. Do you want me to just say Johnimus instead, just to disrupt? No, that? I mean I'm not complaining. It's just like you. It's those two notes. There's like an interval that just screams yeah. that song to me every so, time. Yeah, yeah. With that said, uh, check out the podcast, like podcast v v version of the show if you want to, you know, add it to your playlist on Spotify and whatnot. Whatever the hell it is you, you can do. Um, with that said, I would like for you all to roll initiative. Give me a hand. Uh, like, uh, initiative. Up yogurt. <laughs> ha ha! Got him. What? I took off a key. Where the fuck did I put it? I love how, like, you got brownie M and M's, and I'm here like my snack oh, wait, is like a healthy Greek salad. Uh, me sal lame. Okay, salad is fire though. I like. Oh, and Greek salad, salad is particularly good. Well, it's tomatoes and feta. feta. Yeah, it's yeah, tomato, cucumber, uh, and feta with mm. olive oil and balsamic vinegar. Can quickly, I used to get that jacks. from a Greek place when I was in uni. There was a Greek place really close to me. I'll get that shit all the time with uh, oh, cunt. gyros. <clears throat> Jaros. Jaros. I got a 19. Ooh. I rolled for Jax as well. I got a better roll for him, but he has a fucking negative. Oh, okay. I remember you got, you've got a Syrian advantage. with a big natural 20. Nice. Well, looks like puss. Mm. Got advantage, remember. I know, I just rolled it. Nice, Because I rolled and then went, ah, oh, that's a shit roll. And then went, oh, wait, I got an advantage. Yay. Oh. How'd we get. What? All right, Other initiatives like... 20 plus, please. Guys. Yeah. 15 to 20. 18. Uh, 17. 19, 19 as well. Uh, My which... dex is better. I'm, oh, I'm pretty sure Duke's dex is higher than... I'm plus three. Brooks, Everybody plus three. but me. Plus three as well? Okay, okay, well, decide yeah. which one goes first. Roll off, roll off. Do you, you want to roll, roll off or do you want to roll off? I should roll off, I should roll off. Uh... I roll off 10. I rolled a 10. Is that plus modifiers or flat oh, 10? Roll off, roll off. Roll we off both again. have plus 3. What does it fucking matter? <laughs> roll off again. Roll off again. Come on. 5. 6. Oh! So we got Davian. And then roll we off got Brooks. Was it Kess with an 18? I got uh, yes. Se se 17. 17. 17. Yeah. Okay, so a Lazarin oh, with 18. Kess, 17. Uh, what did Jax and Diagon roll? I got a 12. 12? Uh, Jack's got a 16. Wham! Okay. Jack's with a 16. Diagon. 12. So, get it to so she gets with that to said, you first up in the initiative order is Siren with her natural 20. Oh, she a baddie. And she is going to... Um, knock an arrow. And fire it at the fucking Hydra. She deems is the biggest threat. So let me quickly get that all ready. Hold on. Which one's going fucking shit? Um. Boom. All right. So she's going to shoot an arrow at the Hydra. 
Natural 20 again! What a fucking He's legend. <clears throat> Alright. Quickly go. Uh, longbow. 1d8. Oh, 7. So that's 14. Plus 2 is 16 points of piercing damage on the Hydra. Oh, daddy -o. Boom. Uh, and she's going to remain where she is. Um, Davian. Now, I assume I can't blind all of it. So, maybe blinding hours are off the menu. I am immediately going to Hunter's Market. Okay, the Hydra? Yep, which Hello, will team. remove my favorite foe from the Priest. Uh, and I will... Remind me, the Serrated Arrows, it's a D6 piercing? No, D6 slashing. Yes, and then and half then of the damage you dealt, it that... will take the next turn, or at the start of his turn. Not including Hunter's Mark, so just like the... Correct. So the... Including the modifier, though? Correct. Okay. Uh, yeah, I will... Half I will of the total knock... damage dealt by the actual, like, arrow. Yeah, Which okay. includes your modifier. I'll, I'll knock a Serrated Arrow, and... Okay. Uh, I am going to aim. Does it matter where I aim? Should I specify where I aim? Uh, no. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> 19 to hit. That hits. So that is a D6 and a D6. Ooh. Five for the arrow, four for the hunter's mark. Okay. So the arrow did eight. And then 12 total. All right. So it'll, it'll take damage. another four damage on the start of its turn. Right? Eight? Yeah. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Boom, boom. Uh, boom. 12 slashing now. And another, and another four, four later. Yeah. Okie dokie. Is that your turn? Um, let me see. Um, I'm going to just run south and into the corner. Actually, no, I'll go north, actually, since I'm closer. Uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, 20. Yeah, that's 30 feet to get, like... It's yeah, 30 just, feet just to get here. Put myself further from it. Okay. Nice. All right, perfect. All right, Brooks. I mean... Like, fuck, what do I do here? I don't know. What do you do? <laughs> I draw. I bonus action rage, and I move forward, and I attempt to hit it with a hand axe. Okay. Roll an attack. Natural one. Uh, no, and you uh, manage to drop your hand axe into the water on the floor. Fuck! Yikes. Okay. Uh, <laughs> fuck! That's my turn. Oh boy. It is now Rixal's turn, who has a Daigon right next to him. So Rixal is going to is going to cast hold person on you. Rude. Uh, I would like for you to make a wisdom wisdom saving throw. Yes. Fifteen. That is enough. You Hell uh, yeah. resist. The hold person, and that is it's his turn, uh, much to his annoyance. Um, Belazrin. How far away is the Hydra from me? The Hydra is 16. currently 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45 feet away from you. All right, quality, I will cast Fairy Fire okay. on it. Ooh. Make a deck save for me, please. 19. Motherfucker. Oh. I rolled really high, sorry. Yeah. Shit. Well, mm -hmm. that's my turn. Oh. <laughs> uh, I will... Nah, fuck, I'll stay where I am. Okay. Yes. Um, I want to move forward 15 feet, so I'm 30 foot away, and cast Witch Bolt on the Hydra. I need okay. to have music right now, dude. What am I doing? Witch Bolts? It's just yep. a little hit, right? Pretty sure? Yep. Go for it. Oh, fuck yeah. Okay. Um, a dirty 20 to hit. That hits. Well, no, actually, dirty. It was a twenty-two, but either way. Um, yeah, it is. <laughs> oh, misses, weirdly. 
20 would hit, but 22? It's too much. You over Too much. Imagine, uh, imagine uh, an actual AC like that. We would hate you so much. You have <laughs> to roll like under, under 15. Under like 15. Only, only evens or odds hits or some shit like that. Uh, that that is um, 14. 14 lightning damage. damage. Lightning damage. Yep. Quickly check. If it has any resistances, it does not do lightning damage. Okay, 14? Totally see that being yes. like a fey creature. Where it doesn't um... matter what you roll, just odds or evens. Boom. All right. Is that your turn, Cass? Yeah, that's my turn. What does Jax do? Uh, Jax? Mm -hmm. At this point? Jax is going to just shoot at it with a crossbow, I guess. Okay. Then I did. Uh, 16. That hits. For two points of piercing damage. Wow. <laughs> he has a minus two, so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is, is Jax going to move anywhere? Um. No, he's pretty happy where he is. Okay. Daigon. It is your turn. Oh, uh, remembering what <laughs> Elazarin said about sleep and weakening targets. I just want to try and take a bunch of chunks out of this dude's health. So we're just going to go for... How do I want to attack? We're attacking. I'm just deciding how. Um... Excuse me. Yeah, we'll go ahead and do an attack with the spear trying to just like plant it down in the ground and like shove mm -hmm. it into his his foot like through his thing so also like pinning him to the ground uh that's not great that's a 15 to hit doesn't hit fuck okay you know, i missed quickly uh put his foot away and uh you just you just jab the ground all right well if the spear's stuck in the ground i'm not gonna do my bonus action <laughs> For a key point flurry of blows Hell and yeah. try and take two unarmed strikes on the bitch and go for a double punch. That's a dirty 20 and a 16. Dirty 20 hits, 16 just hits. Hell yeah, okay. Uh, it's still only a d4. Big sad, okay. So those are the first punch is seven and the second punch is five points of bludgeoning damage. So 12 total. Alrighty. And the spear is just stuck and standing up in the ground next to me. Okay. Uh, and that's my turn. I'm not going to move. Understandable. It is now the Hydra's turn. The Hydra is going to move around. Don't to take four damage. He does take four damage. That is correct. Boom. He's going to move. And it's going to leave your melee, Brooks, so you do get an attack opportunity. He's going to... Uh, fuck yeah. Oh, he going here. up to all y'all. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm... I, I haven't drawn my other axe yet, so I'm just going to punch it, I guess. Go for it. It's a 10. To hit? Yep. Doesn't hit. Great, I'm rolling well. And with that... Him having five heads means he can bite five times. He's going to bite Siren, Jax, Elazarin, oh and Kes. God. He's going for Elazarin twice. Oh! So the first oh, the one shit. on Siren. Get fucked, yogurt man. The first one, the first bite attack is on Siren, which is a. 15 to hit, which does hit. So Siren takes... Um, oh, roll a one on the damage die. Siren takes four points of piercing damage. Boom. The next one is Jax. Natural one. Nice. First one on the Because it'd be rude to kill Soko's character. First one on the Lazarin is a 16 to hit. Misses. Holy shit. Hit. Because of Jax buffing my Second armor. one is a 19 oh. to hit. Yeah, that hits. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh, you take 10 points of piercing damage. And the last one... That's the, literally the sound the last one makes. <laughs> last one for Kess. 
is also a 19 to hit. Ah, fuck. <laughs> and like, you take punk, punk. you take five points of piercing damage. Okay. Karma okay. for the spiders, that is. <clears throat> Alrighty. I do shit with the spiders. <laughs> and that is the Hydra's turn. It is now Jeremiah's turn, and Jeremiah is going to shoot. Get behind <laughs> Daigon. I'm surrounded! Which means he's flanking oh. you, so he gets advantage. And he's you going to take his Don't scimitar no. and slash at you, Daigon, no. with advantage, no, because no. he's flanking. No. Which is a 17 to hit. Da ah, fuck yeah, that hits. That hits. You t oh my god, rolling terrible damage though. Uh, you take Good. seven points of slashing damage. That's terrible! Yes. Oh my word, I'm so squishy! <laughs> you all are, a little bit. I know! Okay. I'm already okay. bloodied. Yeah. It's legit. <laughs> yeah. Alright. And that is Jeremiah's turn. Back to Sirin. Who now has a Hydra all up in her grill. So she is going to cast Poison Spray, which she can do because she's a Yuan T, uh, which is a DC 12 con save for the Hydra. Oh, wait. Wait, that's a nine. So the Poison Spray does hit. Hell yeah. Or five points of poison damage. That's her turn. Davian. I'm gonna shoot him. You gonna shoot this him? Is really, I know this is really pushing the boat out for uh, second level ranges everywhere. <laughs> but I think I'm gonna shoot it. That's crazy. Oh. Yeah, no, I shoot the Hydra. Yeah, okay. Oh, yeah, 23 to hit. That hits. Yeah, these are the regular arrow. Just one of the regular arrows? Okay, okay, okay. Yep. Oh, gross. Uh, seven points of pierce. Did you include your hunter's mark there? Yeah, oh, yeah. Okay. Three it's on hunter's mark, one on the D8. <laughs> oh, that's unfortunate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Hey, man. Damage is damage. Is that your turn? You need um, anywhere? You're staying there. Uh... I want to. I'll move along that north wall to the west, like towards Diagon, as far as I can. As far as you can? You have 30 feet? Mm hmm. Uh, 15, 20, 25, 30. So you'll be able to get to the oh, corner over here. Okay. Oop. All right. Yep. That, that'll do it. Alrighty. Uh, Brooks. Can I pick up my hand axe while yes, I'm can. moving? Cool. I will use my object interaction as part of my movement to pick up my hand axe. And sure. I will move forward. And... Forward as in towards Daigon? No, towards the Hydra. Okay. I'll move towards the Hydra. Okay. I, 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 Daigon's not bloody yet, is she? Uh, so yes or no question? I, I don't know what's bloodied again. Half. Like, no. I felt, Half or less? No, then I'm not, no. Then I will move towards the Hydra. Like been in melee? Uh, yep. Okay. Uh, I'll swing with my hand axe. Fuck! Just as an FYI, uh, you don't flank because it has several heads and it can keep That's an eye fine. on a lot of different things. Just to make sure that you're aware. Uh, it's immune to flanking, boys. Fuck me. Uh, it's a well, natural I mean, two. It has five people around it and it has five heads. So no. it has one head yeah, to no, I range. get it. Uh, it's a natural two. Mm. Yeah, it's unfortunate. At least you don't drop then... the hand axe this time. That's true. So I've rolled a 1, a 5, and a 2 this combat. Oh boy. Good job. Uh, <laughs> and then I wouldn't have been able to draw my second hand axe because I've used my free object to pick one up. So I'm just going to go for another bunch. Go for it. It's a natural 9, so 14. Doesn't hit. Fuck Just me! Misses, actually, yeah. I le legitimately <laughs> a one, a five, a two, and a nine. Yeah, you're not doing well. This is like I'm Duke, not. That one episode a, a couple of weeks ago where he just constantly wrote like shit. Yeah, the the festival episode. <laughs> do we reckon? Do we reckon a snake probably speaks to chronic, right? If it speaks anything. 
Well, the other the snake people have been speaking draconic, so. Oh, then I'll just. <sighs> Fuck you, you big snake, fucking bastard. Let's see if it. Fun fact. Does anything. The Hydra stat block does not indicate it speaks any languages. Oh. Well, then I hope it understands yeah. by me flipping at the bird. Maybe, perhaps. <laughs> uh, any of its heads looking at me. Yeah, well, like, you fucking like that. Here, yeah. okay. And that's the rest of my turn. Just to bite your finger off. Huh. Rixal is now Snap. up. <laughs> oh, I'm ready. Bring it on. He's going to cast Cure Wounds on himself. Oh. So he heals. What a uh, pussy! What is it? One d8. Yeah. Plus his spellcasting modifier. Not so I. He, Fuck with. he heals for when eight. bosses heal. What's That's that shit? I mean, I mean, he's not the boss here. That's true. I mean, you're not the boss of me now. In a way, he is, but also in a way, he's not. <laughs> That's true. He's um, the boss. But he's not the boss monster. <laughs> exactly. So he heals himself, that's his turn. Um, Elazrin. Holy fuck out, it's my turn already, Jesus. Yes, uh, I will put up the fucking magic dome of special, special not die. Special um, not die? Yeah, so it's 30 foot radius, just so it's gonna get everyone who is near me. So that's what, Kess, Jax. <clears throat> 30 foot radius is just like, yeah, like everyone, everyone in the circle. Davian and Dagon, right? Yeah. Yeah, uh, the double D's. Uh, and then I am going to cast a healing word on myself. Nice. I can't do cure wounds. <laughs> it's an action. Oh, great! Oh, I heal for five. I'll take oh, that. Go. I only rolled are, you, are you still bloodied now? Nope. Yep. And because it's in my turn, I roll my D6. What was the D10 on my D6? Because of your bubble. Very nice. It's my little special bubble. Mm. I love hearing him talk uh, to his dice instead of us. Yeah. I was, uh, talking okay. to, I was literally talking to my dice. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. All right, is that your turn? Come on, roll daddy a big number. Yeah. No, it was, why the fuck is this dice in the wrong... Kess, it is your turn. Uh, I'm going to use my action to uh, inflict more witch roll damage. Go for it. Roll damage. Uh, 14, again. 14 points of damage, very nice. I'm also going to move back, so I'm still within, like, at the very edge of 30 feet away. That does provoke an attack opportunity? Yep. Okay. 30 oh, feet God. away? Yep. You'll, you'll be, like, here. Okay. 25 plus 5, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, you do take uh, an attack opportunity. Uh, 12 to hit? Nope. So you manage to just duck as one of the Hydra heads goes for a chomp. Um, and managed to get the fuck out of there. Is that your turn? Yep, that's my turn. Right. What does Jax do, Ethan? Uh, nobody in the group looks bloodied right now, right? No. Oh. Nope. Um, he is going to stow his crossbow and hit it with his mace. Okay. For a 15. 15 to hit? Yep. Just hits. Everything I've rolled for Jax above 10. Jax Everything I've rolled for Brooks. This combat so far. That's crazy. Uh, he does one point of damage. Hey, that's still one more point than Brooks. This He's time. done a total of three. Brooks has done nothing but <laughs> swear at it. Okie dokie. Yes, gets 8, 10 HP. Oh. Me? Yep. Yeah. Wow. Is she, no, she's in the bubble. Hmm. She went to be 30 feet away from the Hydra, so she would technically be on the edge of the bubble, right? So yes, just about. Because a 30 foot yeah. radius, right? From me. Yeah, yeah. from me. Yeah. Yeah. She's... yeah. Math is hard. Yax gets 6. Jax gets Yax. 6 temp HP. Yeah. Oh, I can't edit a sheet, so I have to write things down. Welcome. Alright. Is that Jax's turn? Uh, yes. Alright. Daigon. Uh, now Which that do do? they're on either side of me, I mm -hmm. want to do attack action and then bonus attack on M strike. So I'm kind of the way I do it is I lean over to do like a, a forward punch right into the priest man's stomach. But then while I'm leaning over, I do a back kick with my leg to kick the Jeremiah behind me. Okay. Is the goal. <laughs> All right. That so, is, uh... I rolled the same number for both of them. So okay. it's a 16 to hit either of them. 
and quickly check what uh, it just hits Rixal. Okay. And it hits Jeremiah. So yeah, both hit. Fuck yeah. So they both. Uh, Rixal takes seven points of bludgeoning damage, and nice. Jeremiah takes six points of bludgeoning damage. Ooh. Very nice. Okie dokie. And then turn? just back in my stance. I'm, I'm not taking the dodge action or anything. I'm just, I'm just saying for a flavor, I get back in. All right. Then it is now the Hydra's ready to turn. Go. And the Hydra. Double win. It's going to go for five attacks again. Two of it, two of which on Brooks, one of uh, on on the other three oh. that are in its melee. Oh, see all. So the first one on Brooks is a eight to hit. N no. Second one is a fourteen to hit. No. There you go. Oh hell yeah. Sirin hell no. is a five to hit. Jesus. Jax no, no, no. is an eighteen to hit. That would hit Jax. I'm, I'm assuming. Uh, yes. It, yeah. <laughs> yes. Big blue man. Oh, that's the wrong die. I was like very oh, low AC. On D10. Um, five points of piercing damage on Jax. Oh, that's not bad. Ooh, natural nineteen on yeah, Lazarus. Yep. Yep. Or five points of piercing damage. Oh, fantastic! Piece. There you go. That was a, that was a, that was an okay turn for you guys. <laughs> that could have gotten a lot worse. Okay. Yeah. Um, Jeremiah is going to. He just got kicked in the stomach. He's going to attempt to constrict you, Daigon. Ew! I don't like that. Uh, 14 to hit? No! No as in yes, that hits, or no as in no, that doesn't hit? No, sorry, no, it does not hit. AC okay, 15. Okay. I was gonna say, because it sounded like, no, as in like, oh, fuck, no, it hits. Sorry. Okay. No, sorry, okay. like, no, it's You like managed a... to just duck under him as he tries to wrap his, uh, wrap his, wrap the, the his arms around you. Okay. That's Jeremiah's turn. Back to Sirin. Who? Let's have a look, see. 90 foot range. Uh, okay. That will also fuck over Diagon, so she's not going to do that. So instead, Siren is just going to fire an arrow at the Hydra. Hmm, it's an eight. Doesn't hit. The arrow just whoosh, flies past. Davian. Now this one's gonna really shock you. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> what happens shock. next will shock you. Put your, put your seatbelts on, guys, because uh. <laughs> strap I'm, in. I'm gonna shoot the Hydra. Oh shit! <laughs> wow. With a 17 to hit. That hits. With a regular arrow. And I'm going to deal 13 points of piercing damage. Nice. Very nice. So fuck you, Hydra. Mm. All right. Uh, and then I'm gonna... I'm gonna move like <laughs> south or west. Mm -hmm. Thirty. Let's look at you there. Darren gets well. seven ten HP by the way. Oh, Sarin Sarin gets seven. Yes, Saren gets seven. Okay. Oh. You don't get nice. shit. You don't get shit. Oh, yeah. Uh, let me quickly mark that on her sheet. Hold on. Temp 7. You don't get shit because mm -hmm. you did something unpredictable. Very nice. Okay. Is that your turn, Davian? I assume, I assume so, right? Yeah, that's everything. Yeah. That's everything. Brooks. Take a wild guess. You missed both your attacks? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to attack with my main hand axe. Natural fucking 20, baby. There Let's go. go. There you go. There Ooh, it is. There finally. It is. Uh, how much damage do I do again? I haven't rolled damage or combat because I haven't hit until now. Have you been hit since you raged? Nope. I my rage has done nothing for me because I've not yeah, re but my reduced question, is any this, damage. Is it still up? This is turn three. Uh, no, I don't wait, have to hit. I just have to make attacks. No, you do have to you hit. You have to hit. 
You have to hit. Mm, no, if you haven't attacked a hostile creature. Oh, I have attacked a hostile creature. Never mind. I have misread this the entire time. <laughs> <laughs> the entire time. <laughs> I mean, it, 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 did, it didn't. Oh, guy. It made zero difference because I had no bonus actions anyway. So yeah, I just. That's true. All right. Cool. Uh, so that's 13 points of damage on the first one. Ooh, spicy meatball. And then I'm going to draw my other hand axe and go again. Oh no, sorry, 15 because of rage damage. True. Okay. Uh, that's a dirty 20 to hit. That hits. That is another uh, five points. 20 total, if I'm not mistaken? Yes, 20 total. I'm just going to... Fucking try and bury right. my hand axes in dealt, this thing's last. Because you dealt 20 points of damage in one turn. Uh oh. One of its, he its heads. And just goes oh, limp. No. And falls off. Oh. I took off one of its heads. Yep. That could be bad, though. We don't want that. If you deal 20 damage in one turn, one of the heads will die. One. Oh, one turn is in like one full go of combat. Uh oh. Yeah. Not, not one move, one attack, but one turn. So you dealt 20 okay. damage in your turn total, which is just enough. So one of the heads did. Okay. I'm scared. Is that your turn? Okay. Uh, yes. So it's it's per turn and not per round. That's correct. That's really interesting. That's a weird design choice, wizards. Um, no. Don't do so much damage. Got it. <laughs> or do we don't know? We don't know if it's. Don't know. I don't know. Yeah, 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 like in character, like oh, it's one of the heads just fucked off. Okay, interesting. I mean, yeah. <clears throat> Brooks doesn't know shit. Brooks just gonna keep hitting. Mm -hmm. Uh, yeah, that's my turn. Okay, Rixal. Yeah, fuck you. Rixal is going to. Leave me alone. Is just going to oh, so... bonk. Daigon with a scepter. No. He don't want to do that. Oh, natural 19. The cat to horny jail. Fuck, yeah, okay, he won't do that. You take... Six points of bludgeoning damage. <laughs> that is his turn. Elasrin. I'm starting to wobble on my feet a wee bit. How far away is Jeremiah from me? Fuck me. Um, From you? Sure. Yeah. 15. 40. Uh, 40 plus 25 is 65, uh, 90, 95, 100, 105. Perfect. I'm going to... S I want to do this. I want to step back, I want to step to the left of the Hydra. Like here? Just so it's out, well, one more, one more way so it's no longer fucking... Fucking me with spells, being too close. Wait, how far away do you want to be from the Hydra? Ten feet. Ten feet. Okay, so five. You're yeah, yeah. So that's where you are right now. So do I take attack of opportunity? No, because you don't leave his melee technically. He still will. He still give me disadvantage on a ranged spell attack. Um, so I'm trying to get out well, of. he is not in your melee. You are. You are in his. So I don't know what the exact wording is for that. Uh, Neither do I. If, that's why I asked my DM. I'm gonna quickly look it up. Uh, um, I think in the rules it just specifies five feet. It's not. The melee. Yeah, uh, disadvantage on your attack roll if you're within five feet of a hostile creature who can see you and isn't oh. incapacitated. And you are ten yeah, feet, so you are no longer casting yeah. disadvantage. Cool, and I will cast Guiding Bolt. Ooh, okay. So. Ooh. It's just a roll for you, right? Yeah, sure? it's just a roll for me. Yeah. Let's take your flame as a deck save. Right. Yeah. Yes. Oh, come on. Don't fuck this now. Okay. Okay. 24. 24 to hit? Yes. Yeah. That it does. It takes 4d6 damage. Go for it. Uh, that is 15 points of damage. 15 points of damage. And the next attack on it has advantage. Okay. Very good. Oh, Brooks, you healed for 6 temp HP. I didn't have to mention. 6 temp HP? Thanks, Dad. Yeah. And I get 
Oh, I get six as well. Hell yeah. There you go. And that's my turn. All right, Kess. Uh, I'm going to uh, just deal more damage. Which bolt, baby? Mm. Nice. 13. 13 points of damage? Yep. 13 lightning. Okay. Very good. Is that that's your turn? it. Yep. All right. <clears throat> Um, do you want to do the temp HP thing, or are you already, oh, yeah. are you already at max? Uh, I mean, I think she's... Do you take damage, Kess? Nope, I I still have 10 temp. 8 temp will be what you have. What, am? Um, uh, eight, uh, 8's the max, not 10. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh, never mind. Then That's I why have it's eight. that. That's why it's that, not that. that oh. no. <laughs> I don't know. I heard 10. <laughs> I don't know why. Don't ask me. All right. In two levels time, that'll be the max. <laughs> True. Uh, all right. Uh, let's see. Let's cast turn done. Jax. Uh, is anyone... Anyone around us, like, really heavily... Is anyone around us bloodied? Me, but I'm not around you. You're, you're bloodied <laughs> now. Okay. Uh, but yeah, Lazarin's not anymore. Far nope. I'm far away. Because he was... Okay. Uh, he... Dagon hasn't made any clear moves to get the fuck out yet, right? Not like... yet, no. Okay. In which case, he's gonna hit the Hydra with his mace. Okay. There's my Brooks rolls. Uh, that's an eight total. Doesn't he hit? Um, this is a bad idea. <laughs> that's his turn. All right. Uh, he him. gets five temp. Me? Is you? Um, I will go again to do a kick. Uh, I'm gonna this time like do a spin kick to hit um the the not Jeremiah, other man whose name starts with an R. Rixal. Rixal. But then while I'm turning away, I'm also whipping out a healing potion from my uh bag and just like chugging it while I reach out to do the kick. Okay. So the healing potion is the bonus action. The kick yeah. is my attack action. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah! Oh, I rolled the dice off the table. Let's try this again. Fuck! That's a 15 to hit. Just misses. Yep. Uh, it's it's too hard to drink a potion and do a spin kick. At yeah, the same understandable. Time. Can't understandable. be accurate. Mm. <laughs> now my healing potion. Is it 2d4 plus 2? A regular healing potion? Yes. Okay, fuck me. Well, I heal for 6 hit points. I rolled a 3 and a 1. There you go. All right. Okie dokie. Is that your turn? Yeah. Now the Hydra, with four heads left, angry at Brooks, because you killed one of his heads, is going to bite at Brooks with all four of his heads. First one's all a 16 four? to hit. Me? No, I'm, I didn't do anything. 16 to hit. Uh, a 16 just hits. Natural 18, so that also hits. Yeah. Oh, boy. Natural 1. Br Brooks might be about to hit. down. I'll Natu be fine. Natural 16, so three of them hit. Okay, I'll be fine. Takes half damage, this is fine. What was that? I can say Brooks takes half damage, this is fine. Mm. I'll be fine. I believe. 29, half to 14. Okay, mm. I can take that. <clears throat> um, That's the Hydra's turn. Jeremiah. Oh, that, I thought that was one attack. Huh? Uh, that was all of them? 14? That, that was all of yeah. them, yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, I was a little more worried. I mean, 29 damage in one turn against a group of level 2s is pretty significant, Ethan. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 Okay, yeah. I was just very worried. That's deadly. I was all bravado <laughs> and no actual confidence. Alright, um... Jeremiah is going to attempt to uh, constrict you again, Dagon. No! Natural 1, Don't dude. do it! Natural one. He fucks it up. Ha -ha! Get fucked. Um, oh, wait. At the end of the Hydra's turn, where there once was one dead head, two new ones sprout. So now the Hydra no! has six heads. Look what you did! I didn't do nothing. You did it! But the Hydra so has six heads now. Uh, that's Jeremiah's turn. Sit in. I didn't do nothing. I mean, she did something. He's going to do something uh, a little spicy. Like spice. He's going to move that yes. way spice. while remaining within range of the over the melee of the Hydra to not provoke an attack opportunity. But I believe 
Yes. She's going to back up Daigon here and shoot her longbow. Pog. At Rexal. Don't hit me, please. No promises. <laughs> uh, 19 to hit. So that does hit. Dope. Uh, but we're six on the die, plus two. So eight points of piercing damage to Rexal. And that's Siren's turn. Davian. Uh, I'm going to follow her lead. Okay. And I'm also going to take a shot at Rixal. Okay. okay. Uh, with a... One of the slashing arrows. What are they called? Serrated arrows. This, uh, yeah. Oh, 13 to hit. 13 doesn't hit. So the arrow just oh. falls down, like, onto the ground next to him. Unfortunately, mm, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna move thirty feet towards him. Thirty feet towards him. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> right here. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. Splash, 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 splash. As you do. Mm -hmm. Um. Awesome, Brooks. <sighs> You're muted. I know. I unplugged my mouse, so I had to do it on my fucking stream deck. Hello. <laughs> nice. Nice. I unplugged my mouse, so I'll change it to wireless mode. Um, I'm going to roll to hit this son of a bitch again. Go for it. Natural 19. Hits. Uh, do, 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 do. Uh, fucking minimum damage, so uh, six points of slashing damage for the first attack. Six points of slashing for the first attack. And then I'm going to go for the fucking offhand axe again. I'm just going to try and bury it in one of these fucking necks, foreheads, whatever I can reach. <laughs> Sounds good. Another natural 19. Nice. Uh, this Excuse time me. for uh, seven points seven of points slashing damage. damage. Okay. Uh, All right. That's it. Does Brooks get temp HP? Uh, quibs? Oh, shit. Sorry. Fuck, I keep forgetting. Excuse me. Fuck. Got the yeah. hiccups, me. Fuck you. Fuck you, Tim. Uh, five. Hey, it's all good. There you go. Something. Okay. Five HP is a lot at this level. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yep. Mm. Um, Rixal, realizing insane, that there's now other threats entering his range, is going to cast Spiritual Weapon. And a floating scepter appears beside Davian. And this weapon is immediately going to take a swing to try and bonk Davian. You're being kind of cringe. <laughs> <laughs> uh, which... Uh, it's just... Yeah, okay. Which is a 17 to hit. Yeah. So you take... Ooh. Uh, nine points of uh, radiant damage, I believe. Mm. Right? Mm. Force damage? Sorry, nine points of force damage, Davian. Okay. Uh, and that and the scepter just still kind of floats beside you. Yeah, that is his turn, Elazrin. Uh who wait, well, who cast that? Rixal. Well, fucking being upset that no one hit Jeremiah. Mm-hmm. Um I'm just gonna stab the I'm gonna go up to the Hydra and stab it with a dagger. Okay. Can still ah. How is that not concentration? Real quick, spiritual weapon. Come on. It's not it ain't. Yeah. It's not. You conjure the weapon. It's there. Mm. Yeah. Do I really want to fucking? Mm. Mm. Do I really yeah. want to stab the Hydra? <laughs> yeah. That's what I'm thinking. Do I really want to fucking stab it? I mean, what happened to the putting people to sleep plan? Where'd that go? Oh, that fell out the fucking window very quickly. When the Hydra turned up, out of the window. Out of the window, <laughs> Hydra's in the fucking middle. Could not get there. God damn it. Well, the Hydra's right in the I couldn't get there in time. I'm sorry. <laughs> Dynamic rolling plans. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, Make one of their it. heads fall asleep. I can't do anything. <laughs> I've used up all my spell slots because Fairy Fire fucking missed. <laughs> and to be fair, Davian did mention that even when the creature is asleep, one of the heads will always be awake. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. I will. We're not trying to put the fucking Hydra to sleep, though. Yeah. That's what he just. Yeah, no, that's we wanted he just, the humans. That, what, that's what just got mentioned, though. That's why I said it. Yeah. yeah. I will. 
Oh, fuck. I'll just use fucking Sacred Flame on the Hydra. Fuck it. I'm 10 feet away. <laughs> Deck save, please. Nine. Oh, I fucking miss it. <clears throat> and the hits. Sorry. <laughs> Fails. Fails the save. Fucking cheap. At least my head my... Okay. Oh! <laughs> I'm so glad I did that and not stab it. One damage! Yay! One whole damage? Very nice. Yay! Very nice. It's, it's like it's fucking something. stabbed it! I would have hit! Oh, I hate my life. <laughs> I will... Cry myself Cry. to fucking sleep, I think. Fuck very me. Nice, I very nice. Uh, I uh, yeah, that, uh, that's my turn. Oh, do I get health? I do not. What? Okay. Kess. Uh, I'm going to deal damage again. Go for it. Oh, hell yeah. Max damage 15. 15 points of damage? Yeah. Hot diggity damn. Okay. That's my turn. Very good. Um, Jax. Um, Dagon still hasn't really made a mon run for it. No one in the group is super no. fucking bloody. And I look a little better than I did a few seconds ago because of my healing potion. So Jax is just going to hit it with a mace again. Okay. Natural two. <laughs> Nee. Nee, son. Nee, son. Dagon. Okay. Alright, does Jax oh. get temp? Sorry <sighs> about. Five. Thanks, Dad. Um, Seeing that Siren and Davian started to fire at Rick's all, I'm hoping he's kind of starting to be on the ropes. So I'm going to again go for the double. So a left hook and then an uppercut to him. Okay. Uh, natural 20 Ooh. on one, and then a natural two on the other. Mm. So I'm going to assume my left hook is so strong that my uppercut his head wasn't where I thought it was going to be. Yeah, sure. <laughs> I whiff on the <laughs> uppercut. <laughs> sure. Oh, but, okay, please roll good. Roll good on this d4. Oh, I rolled it off the table. Roll the other d4. <laughs> Fuck. That's a two. Okay. So that becomes seven points of blood. Seven points damage. of damage. Fuck me, dude. Okay. Rexal looks bloodied. Hell yeah. Finally. Okay. Uh, is that your turn? Yes. Okay. The Hydra, with its six heads now, <laughs> is going to bite thrice at Brooks, twice at Elazarin. And once a Jax. Jesus. Fuck you. Jesus. So, so dude, Jax on, on you fucking Jax bullshit. is a 15 to hit. Uh, that hits. That hits. Think about uh, 10 does, right? What details He's a are not baby! Really uh, six points of piercing damage on Jax. Okay. For a Lazarin, a 15 and a 16 to hit. Both miss. Both miss. There you go. Brooks. <clears throat> Natural uh -oh. 20. Yeah. Natural 19. Yeah. And a natural 16. Mm, 16 is my AC, so that hits. So it would have been, would have been 19 to hit. Yeah. Okay. I broke. Um, That'd be fine. Anger beyond. Beyond even the mortal coil. Maybe if you were that one kind of barbarian that doesn't die. Maybe if I was any kind of barbarian, because we weren't level two. Four points of damage total divided by two, so seventeen points of piercing damage. Seventeen? Yeah. I'm still up. I'm bloody. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. But I'm still up. Oh, oh, you have you little oh. shit. Without temp HP, I'd be unconscious. Uh, yeah. Oh yeah. I've got temp HP. You, like you've five. saved me about eleven health. <clears throat> there you go. Um, that's the Hydra's turn. I'm, I'm very hurt. Jeremiah. Is sick of trying to constrict you and is just going, is just going to try and fucking take a bite out of you, Daikon. I. It's flanking, so it gets advantage. Um, no. Natural 17. Yeah. You take. No. Five points of piercing damage. Okay. Nine points of poison damage. I'm unconscious? 
<gasps> there you go. Uh oh. <laughs> there you go. There it is, boys. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. <laughs> that is Jeremiah's turn. Sirin. Couldn't even try to constrict me again. God damn it. <laughs> Seeing this happen. Light, Dagon. Is going to fire another arrow at uh, Rixal. He was a good character, Laura. Make another good one. <laughs> no, we haven't even gotten to good shit yet. 21 to hit for max damage, so that is 10 points of piercing damage. And Rixal is looking very fucking rough. Um, good. Fuck that guy. Kieran gets um, <laughs> six. How many how choices is it? Just shoot an arrow, man. I've fucked up everyone's plan. Well, there are three choices for me to make here. Okay, That's which true. one to shoot? Yes. I mean, which one looks uglier? Which one do you like I, the least? I feel like. I feel Wait, like Rixal. Rixal. <laughs> this man's got to go. This Rixal priest is gonna go. Just kill, kill priest man. Get a priest man gone. I'm just like, do I? You know what? No, okay, I'll shoot Priestman. Okay. <laughs> oh, it's a 13 again! Doesn't hit, unfortunately. Ah! Ah! I go 50 quid. Okay, which one? Wait, which one's Priestman? <laughs> Sorry, what? Which top one's Priestman? The topmost one? Top one, yeah. 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 I'm gonna run behind him so that Diagon is flanking. I'm. Okay. Diagon's am, am I flanking when I'm unconscious? He's not flanking, she's unconscious, but. I'm, well, I'm gonna run in there anyway. Okay. Scrap. So like just right behind him? Use like, bonus action to throw a potion at Dagon's face. <laughs> <laughs> but you just reach over his head. I can't do that you me. reach no. over his head. You're like, pardon me just for like, a second. Sorry, you pour it into my mouth. You reach over his shoulder. Fuck <laughs> oh, it, Sam. Excuse sad. me. <laughs> um, I guess that's going to be my turn. Oh, time. no. Okay. No. Uh, Brooks. Fuck. This man just took a <laughs> chunk out of my neck or some shit, dude. A bite. He sure did. He sure did. Garth Brooks. As much as Brooks wants to go, mm -hmm. he won't be able to do anything until he gets over there, and he's aware that if he leaves, the Hydra might fuck everyone else anyway. <coughs> Plus, <coughs> he's a ball of rage and ego. So. Yep. Uh, most accurate description for ever for a character. A ball of rage and ego. So he's going to drink a <laughs> potion of healing. Okay. There's a bonus action. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, bad, not bad. Uh, so I heal nine points. Nice. And uh, I'm going to use my action... To punch the fucking Hydra. Well, hand axe the fucking Hydra. I was gonna say punch him, what the fuck? <laughs> Why not? Uh, fucking natural 18. It's. Yes! Fuck me, finally, a good fucking damage roll. Uh, finally, some good fucking food. 11 points of slashing okay. damage. Alrighty. Play turn, Brooks. That is my turn. Does he get 10 HP quibs? He does indeed. Oh, he get. Oh, he gets four. Hey, that might save my life. True, 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 true. All right, Rixal. Bonus action: the uh, spiritual weapon floats towards Davian once more and is going to just have another bonk. Natural twenty. Oh, oh I'm no! So right now, I'm so unconscious right now. Oh, we're fucked. I am. TPK oh. time. Can you use twenty feet? Smart. Uh, yes, but Davian yeah. started here. Oh, he did. You're right. Sorry. Which, 5, 10, 15, 20. Yeah. So Motherfucker. Motherfucker. Just makes it. Uh, 16 points of force damage, Davian. I am indeed. Oh, no! We're both down! Oh, boy. Oh, God! Boy. <clears throat> okay. Oh, it's bad. And for his action... Oh. Rixal is going to cast uh, Cure Wounds on himself. 
guys. We cannot you let bitch. anyone other than Soko be the first death in this oh, campaign. Oh, the fucking uh, healing die, though, so... Good! Uh, he heals for jack shit. You. Okay. That's Rick Stahl's turn, Elazrin. Seeing the two people go unconscious. Mm -hmm. uh, can I get within 60 feet of Rick Stahl? Of Rick Stahl? Okay. Mm, so you can move 30 feet, so you'll be you'll be here. Yeah. 20... Uh, 45... Yes. Oh, done. Take a flip on him. So you're moving... Skirt there. Yeah. Deck right. safe, please. Holy. No, 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 no. Natural one. Please. Oh, ah! It's for everyone! <laughs> Yo, good. Seven points of damage. Seven? Yeah. That is... Seven! That is Craig Rebel Hall. his current HP. Get <gasps> oh, <laughs> right. So Rixal falls. Oh, he's got no fucking more. second face of prick, probably. And the right. temple yeah. crumbles around us and everyone dies except us. No. Yeah. <laughs> I will then... Rixal dealt with. The Hydra uh, magically goes unconscious. Well the then, I have a bank tag and I'll be my turn. And I have 10 HP myself. Great. The same number I fucking got. Fantastic news. Love it. Fantastic. All right. Kess. I'm going to run um, diagonally across to where Elias run is, kind of, so that I'm 90 foot away from Jeremiah. Mm, so like here? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to cast Hex on him. Mm -hmm. 20, 30, 40, 50. Yeah, yeah, you're within 90 feet. Okay, cool. I'm going to cast Hex on him, and then okay. I'm going to Eldritch Blast him. Okay. Um, There's a... but keep in mind that Hex is concentration, right? Yep. So I'm, which, which I'm dropping... Drops? Yeah, I'm dropping it. Okay. Dude, there's a just a pile of bodies in there. It's like, I mm -hmm. fell, and then David fell, and Jeremiah's kind of over both of us, so we're all just like... No, no, no. Rick Sal's <laughs> over both of you, and Jeremiah's standing over the top. Oh, sorry, like, sorry, yeah. Rick Sal, that's what I meant. Yeah, not yeah. Jeremiah. Dirty, dirty 20 to hit uh, Rick Sal. That hits, yeah. yes. Okay, cool. Oh, uh, you mean Jeremiah, right? You Jeremiah. mean Jeremiah, that's what yeah. I meant, yeah. yeah okay. How many turns of combo have we had, roughly, by the way? So... Five. Oh, I'm, pretty sure, I'm pretty sure this is turn five. Turn yeah. five, that means it's been four turns of the cool. Just keep an eye on my, um, turn. Okay. Ten points minute, right? of minutes? force damage. Okay. Uh, from my Eldritch Blast. Mm hmm And then... Oops. That went out. Yeah, cool. Max. So, uh, nine points from Necrotic. Alrighty. Very nice. Oh, I guess you get four <laughs> temp HP if you oh, want. Oh, hell yeah. If you've can taken I any damage. Yeah, you yeah. can keep the eight. Okay, cool. Okay. Uh, it is now Jax's turn. Is Brooks still in the dome? I don't think he uh, is. Right? Uh, it just, he just is. Cool, fuck it. Okay. Currently, Brooks and Cass are the only ones in the dome with you, though. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. That's kind of like If it. Jax used his full movement mm -hmm. of fucking 30 feet. Mm -hmm. uh, and then dashed as an action for another 30 feet. Mm -hmm. How far would he be away from the... Uh, from Daigon? From Daigon? Yeah. That would be here. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 50... Like 55, 55, 60? 55. Oh. Not good. Uh, it's a big room, y'all. It is a big old mm -hmm. room. Fuck it. <clears throat> He's gonna cast Sanctuary on himself. Okay. That's a bonus action. Alright. In fact, no, he's gonna hit... This is the wrong order, because I don't play Jax. Um, he's fine, gonna, fine. as long as you'll allow it, he's gonna hit the Hydra with his mace and then cast Sanctuary. Is that uh, a bonus Natural action? Is that a bonus action? Yep. Yeah. Dope. Why is it's, a a it's, a, it's a natural three, so it won't hit. No. And then he's going to bonus action cast Sanctuary on himself. Mm. Okay. What does Sanctuary do again? Uh, any creature who targets him with an attack or a harmful spell must make a wisdom save against his DC. On a yeah. failed save, it has to choose a new target or the attack doesn't happen. All right. There you go. 
Okie dokie. Basically, if Hydra want to bite him, Hydra have to make Wisdom saving throw or bite someone else. Okay. Uh, that's Jax's turn. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. I would like for you to make a death save, please. Here we go! Well, not 20, Laura. Easy peasy. True. It's a 10? Is that good or bad? Save. That saves. That, 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 okay. that it's a 10 or more is a save. I can't so remember if it was 11 or more. It's more likely to more. save than fail at that save. Yeah, but, just barely you're more likely to yeah. save. Yeah. All right. Well, that's All a right, 10. So first one passed. That's good. It is now the Hydra's turn. Here we go. Uh, the Hydra having three and people. One. Three people in its range with six heads is just going for two attacks on each. Okay. So two on Jax first. Jax is a wisdom saving throw. Yeah. Fails for each that. attack. Fails that. Okay. So, that so the attack is going to Brooks instead. And then it has to do again for the second attack. Second attack. Fails that as well. Natural six. Okay. So it's just going to be three for Syrian, three for Brooks instead. Hee <laughs> hee. So Have Brooks, I just killed my own character? Eventually. Uh, <laughs> Brooks. Lowest is a 16 to hit. They all Fuck. hit. Fuck! Okay. Fuck! Oh, we're about to have three people down, uh, dude. Ba -bum. Why is my music turned really sad? Because your music knows. 23. It knows what's about to happen. 11 points of piercing damage on Brooks. Oh, thank fuck for that. Sin. Yeah, I'm still up. Bloodied, but up. It's still up. Siren, two hit. One misses. Oh, she's not going to be up much longer. Four. Mostly, I'm just like, I can't afford to die right now. I can't afford new character uh, art. Six. Ten points <laughs> of damage. Come on, the budget. Ten points we'll of damage. We'll take it out of the budget. <laughs> the least we can do after your character dies. <clears throat> Boom. <laughs> All right. That's the Hydra. Jeremiah. What's Jeremiah going to do? He's going to do Dear it, Ma. isn't he? He's going to do it, isn't he? He's going to be like, there's an unconscious bitch. <laughs> Jeremiah's going to turn some butter. Uh, Jeremiah! He's going to ask me for a dance. I, I'm sorry. He's doing it. It's, but it's, he it, is, well, it's, he is yeah. both intelligent and wise. He yeah, knows it's what you to would finish do. off a target do. when they're down. So he's going to try and jam his scimitar. That's fine, man. He is That's both fine. intelligent and wise. Yes, he is. Maybe he's a bitch. Again, it's it's stupid not to just out of DM trying to save players like that. They're right there, fucking. Mm -hmm. Well, there's what still active threats that are damaging him. Yeah, but he can't get but to. Him, none though. of them are close to. What him. it comes they're down to away. is his mentality. Does he think he's likely to escape? If he thinks it's going to be difficult, he'll probably not. If he thinks How? that he can either escape easily or is doomed anyway, you might as well get the kill in. How rough does he look? Imagine thirsting not, it down. That is okay. so cringe. I mean, he's, he's not bloody at all. He has advantage I mean, that's because you're prone, you're unconscious. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not once. Rolled the same on both dice. And? 11 to hit. <laughs> this is bitch. I rolled, he might be intelligent rolled, and wise. I rolled two eights, which with he's a plus three bitch. to hit makes 11. I coi it. Bro, okay, your good. paws before you Somehow said how missed, what it was was just fucking threading the needle, Laura. Holy fuck! Oh. <laughs> and as it was getting tense, the music was like dum dum dum. The skin of your fucking, fucking teeth. Holy Can shit! Can you stab Rick's all instead? Because we're a pile of bodies. Um, Syrian <laughs> is going to just shoot another arrow at at, at at Jeremiah because she senses the urgency and feels like that group of three that is still by the or yeah that that the other ones near the hijack will be able to do that deal with that. She wants to save her allies first. Um, fifteen to hit, just hits. Look at that. Oh, eight on the D8, bro. No. That's uh, ten points of damage. The Hydra did attack six times last time, last round. Yes. Three on me, three on. Uh, um, which Siren. makes it so that Jeremiah is now officially looking bloodied. Hell yeah. Um, Davian. Death save, please. Here we go. Here we go, gamers. Uh, 20, go, David, let's go! Natural one. What? No! That is That's two true. That is two failed saves. 
Oh no! I gave it a test roll before it was time, and I was like, oh, 17, okay. Oh, you fucking wasted the 17. That's two failed saves for Davian. <gasps> <gasps> Fuck. Guys, okay. Davian's gonna die before we get to see the stork. Oh, what another ranger. Another ranger stork? goes <laughs> to, to the dust. Brooks. <laughs> oh, um, Motherfucker. Shit. Yeah. This has changed everything I've been doing. Uh, everyone else is moving to help the others. <clears throat> Jax is sanctuary. If I leave now, then Siren gets fucked. Plus, I mean, we're not really friends yet. Who cares, right? <laughs> this is the thing. <laughs> Absolutely, Brooks would let her die. But I don't think I have the hit points to take an attack of opportunity. So... Yeah. Or Punch the fucking like hydra. five attacks of opportunity, or whatever. I yeah. don't know if it can I'm take five on you, or if it's just that it could take five if five of us moved away. It, it has six it. reactions right now. It gets six yeah, reactions. Yeah, but I don't know if... I don't... Stay. If you have multiple reactions, does one movement trigger multiple reactions? I don't think it Each head does, can react but... individually to you moving. Oh, that's, no. Yeah. So it's not oh, that the creature bad. has six reactions, it's that the six individual heads each have a reaction. Each have a reaction, Correct. yeah. Yeah. That's fucking such a weird niche rule spot. That's anyway, awful. I don't the have creature, the help. I guess, yeah, no, literally the only creature that has that, that rule. Well, yeah, because any other creature with multiple reactions oh, can no. take, like, two to make two attacks of opportunity yeah, because for one the move. difference here is, um... That it's, it's like a swarm thing where, like, yeah, it's technically exactly. <gasps> acting together but separately. Yes. Uh, yeah, I mean, I don't think I can take another attack of opportunity, so I might as well go out swinging. TPK, uh, here it comes. 17 on the first attack. It's. Not TPK if one of us survive. Sure. Oh, guys, uh, if, if that any of us is... dies. Uh -huh. uh, eight points of slashing damage. Eight, okay. Yo, and if... then I'm gonna attack with my offhand. Mm -hmm. A fucking natural 20, baby. Oh, thank fuck. Come on. Dude, you might be yeah, but to I don't, grow another I don't... head. You're gonna make it grow another head right now with the I damage. Won't, because the max... I can't do shit tons with this because it's my offhand. Um, you say that. I rolled a one anyway. It doesn't matter. Okay, so one, you're fine, you're two, fine. four <laughs> points. Of, Plus eight. Uh, yeah, so 12, 12 altogether. Total. Yo, if any of off? us die... How do oh! I want to finish hey, it sure. off? <laughs> Clutch. Okay, it had, baby. It had 10 um, HP left. Okay. We see the I'm going to wait for it to snap at me mm -hmm. and just sidestep it, put my arm around one of the heads. Okay. Just Big fucking head. pull up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's a strong man. Yeah, just okay. fucking pull up and snap its neck. Shit, okay. Yank on it as hard as you can to pull it down a little and just go fucking hand axe to the chest mm -hmm. and then the other one. And then the other one, and just keep going until it stops moving. And as moving. you do this, all the heads start writhing and, and moving until all the heads simultaneously smack down into the water and the body stops moving, besides the occasional head twitch for a little bit more. Your blood isn't poisonous in any way, is it? Or like acidic no. or anything? No. Good, because I'm fucking coated in it. <laughs> so that remains, uh, then only remains... Jeremiah. Jeremiah. I'm gonna use my movement to start moving towards Jeremiah. You get you get three temp HP. <laughs> my guy, this temp HP has kept me alive. Yeah, that's the only reason I'm unconscious, because I never got any I never benefited from it, so I never got to All right. myself. Yes, no, it's my fault. I'm the one who here. fucking booked right. it. That's I mean. Okay. You're an excellent meat shield. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> um right. According to my uh, notes, that means that it's now a Lazarin's turn. Oh, fuck, how far away is Davian from me? Davian? Like 90 feet, right? I think stupid. Five, 10, 10, 20, uh, oh, wait. Five, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. Yeah, like, 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 like 90. Cause I'm going to move 30 feet up towards Davian. It's close as I can get 30 feet. Mm -hmm. And I'm just going to fucking Sacred Flame. Do I my again? Sacred Flame me. <laughs> no, 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 no. I also thought he was going to send you off you. with a respectful death. Yeah. Burn your it's body. It's time to perish, Davian. There can oh, be only I've one. Enough God. of your shit, boy. <laughs> okay. 
Dex save, please. Death save? Mm -hmm. Dex save. Oh, dex save. Sorry, I'm just... For a minute, you said dex save. I was like, whoa, okay. Uh, 14. Oh, don't be the save. Oh, it is. That is the save. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and it's a cantrip, so it's all or nothing. Fuck. I will... Can't do shit. Can't do shit. Can I... Can I do... No. No? I will <laughs> just give myself... Ooh! Two more temp HP. Because <laughs> okay. I rolled a six. Hell yeah. Okay. Are we close enough that we're in the dome now? Like, Fuck, if we're unconscious, no. our turn, and we would get temp HP, would temp we... HP, nope. Temp HP oh. does not restore you back okay, to life. Okay, okay, okay. Damn it. New. No. Because it's temp Balls. Okay. That's the last one's turn. So I thought, oh, like, big pog, I can just be like, on people, but no. Yeah, that's my turn. Kess. Uh, I'm going to move up my 30 feet towards Jeremiah. I'm gonna shout, um, Jeremiah, your mother could never be so proud of such an abomination. And then I'm gonna Ooh. Eldritch Blast and Hex him. Ooh. Sorry, Hex him, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah I know. <laughs> okay. God. Uh, no that need. is Dirty 20 to hit. Yup. Gone. Which is... Uh, 15 light, uh, if... What? No? What? <laughs> I rolled the wrong thing. Okay. Did you roll 20? Okay. 13, um, force damage. And, uh, 7 necrotic. 20 total? Yep. Okay. Um, how do you want to finish yeah. him off? Yes. Boom! Oh, cool. Oh my god. Oh my god, so I might I, live. We might live. I might live. What a turn. Um, the force damage blows him back against the wall, and the the hex um, crawls up around his skin, and his veins kind of like shudder a dark black before he just falls to the ground. Okay. Spice. And with this, act swiftly. The time of the S is of the essence for Davian. When I mean, I'm sprint to Davian and medicine check him, try I try and stabilize him. I try and stabilize. Make him. a medicine check. We have potion. Why would you do something that's a check? Why would you have a potion? That's a check. I'm I uh, I'm gonna run over and give Daigon one of the healing potions I have. Okay. <laughs> that is a twelve. Guide yourself, man. Who who he rolls for the healing potion? Oh. Um. <laughs> Cass, I would assume because I hate Cass, this game. Cass is the one administering the potions right. as she rolls. I hate oh, caring right. about something that a shitty dice can take away from me. <laughs> <laughs> it's so unfair. So Davian, it, we got uh, close, but Davian is stable and will oh, remain unconscious oh. for another three hours. Okay. Unless you, yeah. unless some gets potion. Unless he gets healed. Yeah. I will kind of call. Uh, I'll call out and be like, anyone have a potion? I've stabilized I, him, but I, he's I, still I, unconscious. Got seven points, um, <clears throat> Dagon. Seven. Hell I'm yeah. I'm out of potions, but. I'll give I'll give um, Davian the other one. Perfect. You got potion? Oh no, Kess just said she'll give Davian the other her other potion. Okay. Mm -hmm. ja perfect. Where did you these fucking potions from? Jesus Christ. So you probably stole them. Probably the same place you got the fucking horse and cart. You're oh, not wrong. You're you can't right. say shit because you're still <laughs> you're unconscious. <laughs> well, well, um, seven for a Davian. Oh, well. I would like to search the priest's My God. stuff. Find any Dude, that things. got close, bro. Yeah, <laughs> that was stressful. Ate it. Oh fuck. fuck! I would. That I'd like so to search fuck. through search through priest man, please. You gonna search priest man? Yes. Please. Yes, pause. Make an investigation check. Oh. <sighs> Nine. Uh, his scepter looks pretty cool. I'll take it. Has, <laughs> has a little snake motif. Oh hell yeah! I'll take that. Uh, as as I stand back up, uh, I want to mm -hmm. try and give Kess, not as in like to drink, but just offer her the healing potion I had in my inventory since she used hers on me. And I'll sign like here for you. I will. I'll take it. And then I'm just going to give her like the tightest bear hug. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I'm going to sit up and, and give Daphne a hand up. up. Contemplate my mortality. For a Sirin approaches <laughs> you all and looks at you. Was close. 
<sighs> you all right? Mainly looking at that. We're just gonna sit against the wall. Where's the stone? Um. Can What's I take stone? the two? The two. Are you are you going to look for it? I'm asking her. Oh. I don't know. It should be around his belongings. I, I assume. Maybe did, have you checked the. The table? I, mean, I only found a scepter, but to be fair, I've not checked the altar yet. Devin, do you want to help me? Check I expected this? it to be like floating and massive. I don't know why. I just had this vision in my mind of like, you mm -hmm. know, an Ocarina of I... Time. Mm -hmm. when you get the, Devin, you know? do you want me to help you look the altar? Do you want me to, do you want to help I'll, me? From sitting, hold up a hand to. Yeah, I'll give him a hand. Yeah, I'll, I'll do the. I'll do like the. I'll do like the wrist grip. Oh, yeah, stand myself up again and just. I mean, there's a lot of blood. And um, yeah, I'll have a rifle through whatever I, I can, the altar. Okay. I will, I will, can I guide him and assist him or just one? Sure. Hell yeah. So you, got, you can guide it and advantage. While they're doing that, can mm -hmm. I uh, go take the empty potion bottles and collect Hydra Bud with it? <gasps> sure. I got a natural cool. 20. Okay. And a natural 17. Yeah. You uh, search the, d the, the, the table slash desk and find a red... And a, a four red... on the guidance. A red gemstone, about this big, shaped like a tear, red. Like I said. Who find? Who found that? Davian. Okay. Do you take it? Is there anything with it? No. I'm just yeah. I'm gonna snatch it up. <laughs> Lazarin. One down. Yes. Two to go. Oh. Ah! Wait, I'm, assuming, wait, I'm, ass I'm assuming only he heard that. That's only that. that, and that, yeah. that, that, that was <laughs> but that was creepy. <laughs> My He's heart. in a game show. Fuck. It's like a fetch quest. <laughs> oh, Literally oh doing God. an MMO fetch quest. Do we do we see him pocket this works? gem? I mean, I yeah, I, I okay. sat up and was like, where's the stone? And then immediately okay, okay, was yeah, the first yeah. thing I went for. So. Fair, fair, fair. Uh, yes, well, Lazarin, you mind uh, making this all go away? I can't quite do that, but I can... I, I'll just do mending on his clothes, so his clothes look all, like, not dead. I can't. <laughs> you can't. Mm. No, sorry, that's not quite in my, um... I'd love it to be. God, it'd save so I much I appreciate rebirth. the effort, but... Anybody uh, else need their clothing repaired? Because it's been bitten uh, yes. off, as he says, as I, like, repairing my own. Yeah, yeah. I'm mending. All right. mending. There are literal, like, massive holes through my shirt where I've been bitten all the time. And I'm just there, like... What was the spiritual weapon? A scepter? I just yeah. present you my like shirt. A, so I, I, I got these two ripped. I've just been beaten in the spine a bit. No. I, it's not, it's I, not like a floating copy of the scepter that he that he wielded. Oh, I'll, I'll pick up the scepter and be like, well, I mean, I'll take a look at this later, I suppose. I, I mean, we can wait here 10 minutes Hello? if you want. The abomination that Jeremiah turned into, does it have human hands? Like his no. hands still? Or no, it doesn't. Okay. Does, it have, does it have a human um, head-ish? No. I'm gonna... Is it recognizable as Jeremiah? That's no, where I'm going not. with this. Yeah. Um, absolutely not. I will sign to Kess. Normally, we take back a trophy to prove we got him, but I don't trophy. know if they'll believe us. Quickly, just so that you have a reference of what Jeremiah looks like right now. Quickly, gonna fuck with the camera. Uh -oh. Sorry, guys. Okay. <laughs> oh, he looks. Oh, oh shit. he's yeah, just he looks... a snake. He yeah. looked nothing like him. Okay. Buff snake. Buff snake. Yeah. Um, I mean, I don't know. We could. I mean, do um, we do we take the head on the chances that they have some magicy shit that they can take the head on both? I suppose. Well, I think we should take the head of this I, other I one. I want to start and present through... it to these who are around. Mm -hmm. I want to look through the bag he has on him and see if maybe he has like a note or something that like is a personal possession that might help us prove it's him. Make an investigation check. We should try in, and get in his some... snake pockets. We should try he had, some of the, the picture. He had a little like drawstring mm. bag. That was Cox. <laughs> oh, that was not good. Um, that's a it's five. Five. Yeah. Um, so, do you guys boss. want me to quickly? Do you want to race around for 10 minutes whilst I do detect magic, or should we just get the fuck out of here? Uh, I, oh. I suggest... Yeah, I don't want to sit near Before we get out of here... We still have 100 you want Bringing outside, something outside that will scatter oh. the army of I mean, 100 plus waiting I mean, for us. Didn't they say Next that his... Didn't... Your, 
hollow it out and put it on. No, <laughs> didn't, no, didn't they, didn't they say that once the leak... saying, killed your boss, by the way, they're not going to oh, believe that. Oh, that's what I'm saying, we bring his head. We take his head with okay. us. Yeah. Drop of his head. Oh, they all want to fucking kill us because we killed they him. They don't. They're cowards from what they've been to what we've been told. I want to quickly go and once we Hydra. kill if their leader. To, okay. If you want to really convince them, take a Hydra head. Well, I, I mean, I we have one on the floor, right? Yeah. yeah and I signed to Kess. We also, even though they might not believe us, we should probably take Jeremiah's head. We need to prove that we killed something. Uh, I'm gonna nod at her and go with my dagger and start just like soaring it. Oh. The head. I'll I help to... you with my spear. I'm just yeah, trying yeah. to help. Okay. I'll I'm hand you one of my daggers and we'll just like. Did I do you just want a fucking axe? Like. Hold on, hold on. Uh, do. Using my spare vials of jungle remedy. Mm -hmm. I want to collect some hydro blood because someone told us it was worth dollar. I've oh, got some, yeah, didn't you? That's, yeah. I already Guess did that. Got some in the yeah, if you have any empty so vials, can you more. can use yeah. them to collect hydro blood, yeah. I'll pass um Just my empty vials. I'll pass collect. I'll pass my empty vials to Davy and be like, oh collect some more. There you go. There's my empty I'll, vials. I'll collect some right. more. And I will fuck it. Vault. Whilst everyone's doing this, I will spend the ten I'll spend ten minutes doing detect magic. What's the range of the detect magic? Three days worth. It is thirty feet. Feet. But, but I'm going to fucking it, walk right? around because it lasts 10 minutes. So okay. I spend 10 minutes being like, and I'm going to spend like another 10 Eventually, just being like. Eventually, you'll make your way past like the Hydra lair. Yeah. And something gets picked up by your magic radar. Uh, within nice. the lair. Uh, I will. Is it quite. What does. Is it big? Is it small? Because I can kind of see like the outline of thing right now. I'm sure. uh, it looks spherical. Well, oh, like, I mean, I'll, I'll, yeah, I'll dig through and just kind of. Trying um, to find it. You find a buried chest. <gasps> is it is it locked? Does it seem locked? Uh, it is not locked. Oh, they well, probably figured the Hydra guard dog would be enough to, to keep this chest oh, safe. Uh, yeah, I will, I, will, I, will, I will open it up. Okay. There are two red gems in there. And it's a mimic! Nope. It's a mimic! <laughs> 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 uh, Wait no, until you find out the Hydra was in In this chest, you find a pouch with uh, about 60 gold worth of emeralds. Oh, okay. That's and going And a blue orb, which is magical, which is what you picked up on the, the tech magic. I will put... <clears throat> okay, I will put the orb straight away. Like, I'm going to try and sneak it into my bag. Okay, I mean, I don't think anyone is near you enough to really pay attention to you. No. We're, we're like, sawing I'm, the head of Jeremiah off right I'm now. I'm currently oh. offering Dagon and Cass an axe each. <laughs> and I will be... And I will then... Uh, bring out the chest and be like, um, sorry, I thought I'd check where the Hydra was and found this chest has some emeralds in it. I don't know. I mean, that's can kind of I... my specialty. Do you want to have a little look? Do you want some? I can give you. Can I inside check to see if he's lying? What do you mean? You're not, it's not your specialty, isn't No, I said it is my specialty, oh, but I if you want so. some. Uh, what do you want to inside check him on, Kess? Um, Him saying that he only found emeralds. I mean, is there a reason for Kess to not trust that? Yeah, that's. Oh, I literally yeah. had the chest <laughs> open, open, open to with fucking loot. Yeah, I like opened up the chest, like have an open chest in front of you, like I think like I found this. It's open. Yeah, it's open. Yeah, then yeah. So sixty gold worth of emeralds. Yeah, I mean, I fucking. Look at these two doing a shoddy job of cutting this guy's head off and hand them a fucking hand axe each. <laughs> Start hacking away with a hand axe. Takes and a dagger. Roll. Just like I mean, two does anybody, hands. Does anybody want these? Which dagger are you using? Are you a fancy okay? one or? Uh, I have my fancy one. Dagon is using the one that you made. Okay. You, do you guys want me to keep the emeralds or do you want uh, me to give you the mouth? I feel like, well, I mean... I don't want to, you know. Any, I want any, to. Is there any sense keeping them, or are we going to sell them? Well, I mean, I can keep. I. I Lazarin I is probably the, the most well placed to sell them, given his intimate knowledge. I was just Plus, say, if he tries to make a run for it, them. he's also the easiest to beat the shit out of. So. That's true. I don't think and that. I mean, I mean that in the nicest right way there. possible. Jack's he might right be able there. to turn them into Jack something. Jack's a lot taller than you are. Yeah, but he's old. But he's old. I'm lithe. I've got the best of my years ahead of me. I, I don't know if I'd say you're lithe. You really think that okay. it's morally okay to beat up old men? 
do you think it's more okay to kill hydras? You know, I or mean, beat up yes. yes, yes, fair I enough, do. fair enough. No, uh, try to kill shots. us with self defense. That's fair. Um, How are you okay. feeling getting the head? Uh, I mean, I've been to six different brothels and no one's interested. <laughs> you didn't go to, you didn't stay the night at the uh, one that we were. It used to be at. a nightly thing until we started coming out to the jungle. Now it's, it's pretty, Funny. pretty dry. Was talking about the hydra. Oh well, you can help from a hydra. See, they tried to use a spear and a fucking dagger. No, and just like, no, just there's, like glaring, there's a hydra head already on the floor. Fucking daggers at you, Elazarin. I was, I did not mean to say that in character. <laughs> you really fucking did. <laughs> it is now. It is now. Yeah. Um, how, how are you? Are you alright, Siren? Are you like completely I... fucked? Or... I'll manage. I'll manage. I feel that very much. I don't have any more healing potions, but I have, I have whiskey. Maybe once we're out of this um, place. You said it was sixty gold of emeralds. Yeah. 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 Time to distort value. <laughs> <laughs> it's still right. value by thinking she's worth a lot to bring along. So you managed to successfully decapitate the ones you want to decapitate. Um, all of them, basically. Yeah, including a Hydra head. Uh, you managed to all farm some Hydra blood, whatever empty vials you have. With that, um, <clears throat> the door leaving the room is still closed. Fantastic news. But Sirian walks up to the door, starts feeling around, and puts her hand in like one uh, in, in, in uh, a groove in the wall. And benefits of the knowing the ins and outs of this place. The door. Is there anyone immediately outside waiting? No. Um, oh, wow. I'm gonna step forward um, to the top of the stairs. Okay. Um, are there like loads of people? I mean, no, this was just the door. This was just a door of the Hydra room. You still have to. Oh, okay, never mind then. I thought yeah, it was yeah, 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 yeah. No, no, no. Uh... You managed to uh, get to the main entrance, which door is which oh. to which door is still closed, and she looks at you Before... all. How do we want to proceed? Quick question: Before huh? we left the room with the water, can I just say I I fully just like kind of laid down and like rolled in the water just to clean any blood off sure. myself and just sure right, cool. And I picked up my spear. <clears throat> um. What what did she say? How do we proceed? Well, show uh, off the heads and threat them with death. If they your leader is interview. dead. Dare you? I will tap Kess and sign. Do any? Can, can any magic users <laughs> or yourself do that? thing where you amplify your voice with magic to make us appear more intimidating. I can do other things to make me more intimidating. I could cast I mean, I could... Thunderclap, which just makes a crackling thunder sound. I could get their attention for us so they could... Yeah, if you, did if you had to get, our to get their attention no, if we, for us. No, if we do a nice thing together, I could cast uh, a sacred flame up into the air and you do it at the same time and it'd be like right. booming out. Did we... Uh... Did anyone actually see us come in here? Like, sure, we shut the door, but, like, I don't do know. we know for definite that people saw it? We might be able to just open the door and fucking waltz off. I kind of want to make a show, to be honest. Of course Sounds more you fun. do. It's because I mean, it's dramatic as shit, like... I mean, we want to make a show. We want to just disperse yeah. them, show them that the leadership um, is dead, the revolution is down. Who has, who has I the... I don't know about you guys, but I'm not necessarily in a great state for <clears throat> fighting. We're not going to fight them. They're going to be No, we're going terrible. to terrify We defeated both the leader and the Hydra. They're not going to fight us. Yeah, who it's has, the dare um, you try. Who has Rixal's head? Or whatever his name was. We, we just took years. Jeremiah and the Hydra. Okay. We, we didn't did take Rixal, did we? We did. We were yeah, going to. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. We were planning to. Yeah. I mean, it was made very clear that he was important. Yeah. yeah. He, he, we needed his head. Form, so, yeah. Whoever has a head, I'm going to take it from them. So now I have the head. But like, weren't you carrying Jeremiah's head? Because we're the ones yeah, who cut it off. I have, oh, so I have, you have both. Them. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Huh? So, okay. Siren looks at you whenever you're ready and puts her hand like in the groove, so ready to open the door. Oh, get ready with your spell and we'll fire them off together. And do? As well. 
I'm gonna take point so I come out the door first mm -hmm. and re prepare to cast. So um, she opens the, the door. You all walk out, and immediately Siren looks at you, the Lazarus. And I go, I do. Like, just kind well, of like, like fires stomps flame. the floor and casts thunderclap, cracking the stone underneath out. her. And there's just, just like, this out. loud <laughs> gets heard and echoes 100 feet away, to which. Combined with with the sacred flame, make it look like like lightning struck right there. Boom. You have the attention of the entire the entire town, the entire village. They all kind of all the Yuan Ti gather around. Some of which draw their draw their swords or scimitars um, until they see you carrying some heads, and then they just are, they're very apprehensive after they see that. Your your leader is dead. Your creature is dead. I'm going to hold up Jeremiah's head. And your monster is dead and point at the Hydro head. If any of you think you're stronger than all three of those combined, try it. See what happens. And I'm going Ooh. to make um, him, accentuate him... my... No, uh, down the stairs. Drop I'm down gonna, the stairs and they like roll down the... Yeah, I'm going to accentuate my uh, Ganassi traits so crystals grow out of the top of my head oh, around my hairline. And um, I'm going to be standing wind, behind her, looking yeah. as scary and claws out and, like, bristly <clears throat> as possible. Uh, the wind that uh, usually blows, like, around her intensifies her. and it kind of um, billows rather than just, like, gently blast. Okay. Uh, Belle. Yes. I would like for you to roll an int intimidation check with I advantage. Get. I cast guidance on her. Okay. I'm not what sure if this is really fucking terrifying or really fucking hot, but <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, 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 I lean into Brooks. It's a bit of both. Um, I'm terrified how hot it is. What does guidance do? You give me an four. An D four. I, I, I. If that's your thing, then why, why did you ever 66. go see Rihanna? Uh, twenty three. Twenty three. Mm hmm. Everyone fucking scatters. <laughs> Everybody fucking scatters. They're all fleeing into the jungle in different directions, and before you know it, the town is abandoned. Hell yeah, you better fucking run. I'm gonna like, as as I start walking down the stairs, the the wind kind of calms down, and the crystals drop from her head and shatter on the floor like ice. Okay. I give her a high five, or hold up my hand for a high five. I'm just gonna hold up the heads. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like, oh, come on. Oh, true. And I go, oh, oh. And then, sorry, I do like an elbow bump. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay. Well, I'll give you, you a high five. Yes, we should. Um, do you reckon we uh, travel back to that temple we pass on the way here? And oh, definitely. Get some, get some rest there? <laughs> Thank, please, God, yes. to the jungle. Right. We got three different heads. <laughs> Towards nightfall, you arrive at uh, the temple. It's about 7, 8 p.m. Uh, and get ready to long rest. Anything uh, before you all kind of go bed and decide on watches? Sirin kind of looks at you all. I um, have a question. Mm. Oh. Discuss this with Brooks a bit already, but I wanted to ask you all. I want my tribe to be able to work with more settlements besides New Darmouth. Would it be possible for me to travel with you to Eldilon, I believe? And you maybe put in a good word for me and my that tribe. would be wonderful. It I would be my that. honor. Absolutely. We'd love to have your company. Before everyone's too hasty we are in the midst of i suppose investigating yuan t's involvement mm -hmm. in an attempted assassination mm -hmm. it i just will may sign to not be easy to convince anyone to side with you I regardless to... of where you Ooh. might be from sorry uh i signed a cast gesturing to translate for me to davian <laughs> Does that not mean this is the best time? Make sure they don't get hatred too deeply entrenched in their minds and paint a whole race with one brush. I'm gonna translate that exactly as she said it. Unfortunately for some people, it may already be too late. I think I mean, it's, it's worth if, the risk. And with the... 
if it's a risk, help you're of the to people take, who of course, we'll take saved it. both At like the, the assassination the day, attempt and if today. I take this risk and it pays off, it'll benefit both your people as well as mine, mm -hmm. which I think is worth taking a risk for. I just wanted Plus, to be clear that it, if it we might... arrive, okay. um, do we intend on bringing the heads? Did you bring Absolutely. the heads? Absolutely. There's a proof. Uh, if I arrive going... along, uh, along your side and you tell them I helped you do this, mm -hmm. I'm sure mm -hmm. they'll at least hear me out. Right? Mm -hmm. I mean, I think that's being a good word. We'll do more than enough. But yes, that will certainly help. I didn't want to necessarily commit We are kind of a big deal of now in Eldalon, so... Oh, no, we're not. In that case, not. I suggest tomorrow we travel back to Sethka. Mm -hmm. I'll let my leader know. And then I'll join you on the trip back to Eldalon, if that's all right. Sounds, Absolutely. sounds good. Okay. I, I nudge Siren. Do you, uh, do you want to ask something else as well, or...? What? No. No, okay, fair. Maybe later. Right, should okay. we uh, take the same watches as last night? Mm -hmm. Uh, I mean, I can take a watch tonight this time. I can take the watch with with, with Siren again. Well, instead of you, uh, Brooks. Perfect. I'm more than happy to have a night of uh, sleep. <laughs> you Jesus must have impressed. I, w I will sign to Kess. If you take a watch, I would like to take a watch with you. Absolutely. Um, who's taking first and second? Uh, I'll go second. What the fuck's up the Actually, exactly? Go first. <laughs> yeah, I'll go first. Sorry. <clears throat> you go first. Uh, Siren went second last time, so I'm assuming the Lazarin's on second as well. Yeah, I'm going second. So, uh, so then there's a third and a fourth. Uh, Jax will take whichever one the girls Please. don't take, I guess. Uh, Brooks wants to sleep. We'll take third. Sure. Jax does the end. Cool. Hope it works. Jax can fucking tinker. Tinker, tinker. Cool. Excuse me. So, with that, unless there's any RP things you want to do during your rests. Yes, uh, please. Doing your watches. Yes, please. How oh, dare you? Yes, please. <laughs> All right. Davian. RP time. What do you want to do? Um, <clears throat> As everyone's bedded down. Mm hmm. I want to kind of have a little check to make sure everybody's asleep. Um, and you can. Kess, are you in the bedroll fake sleeping or are you in the vessel? Uh, I'm in the vessel and I stuff the bedroll again. Okay. So you walk past Kess's uh, bedroll and don't see any movement and the rest of the people seem to be asleep unless anyone is pretending to sleep. <clears throat> I'm I'm so picturing actually... like a room, like one room at the top of like a ziggurat thing, right? Yeah. And it just opens straight out onto mm. like stairs down. Yes. Okay. So I'm gonna just take a stroll. How high is the doorway? Like, if I was to go out, could I easily climb up the way that Diagon did to perch on top um, of it? Um. Yeah. 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 Okay. So I'll climb up, mm -hmm. and I'll find like a secure spot to sit down. And I will uh, take the tear out of my pocket and sort of cuff it in both hands. Mm -hmm. And I'll just say, if there's if there's if there's two more, where where are they? And I'll just like intently stare at the tear. The answer that you seek is Streetha. Is what? <laughs> Streetham. Streetham? Which is uh, a city to the north uh, west of Eldilon <clears throat> along Based the coast. Streetham. Along the coastline. Oh, of oh I see it. Okay. And then from my vantage point, I will keep watch. Okay. And that concludes your watch. Okie mm dokie. Uh, second watch was? Uh, me and Siren. Siren wakes up uh, as, as Davian wakes you up, uh, Lazarin. Elazarin, right? Hello, Siren. Yes, that's, that's me. 
I have to ask. Go on. You're a religious man? Yes, you could say so. See, my people, all we knew up until about 30 years ago was Seth, some other uh, deities. Uh, hold on, I had a list. <laughs> Of course, the second I talk about it, I... Seth, Zahir, Mershok, if you're feeling a certain type of way. <laughs> All of which... Pretty horrible. Who is it you, worship? I am a follower of the Golden Lady, Joaquin herself. What's, she... what's her story? What does she stand for? She stands for commerce, for traders, all around, for the good prosperity of of those in the trade. She she helps protect and helps keep watch. Religion has always interested me because uh, I find it fascinating. People can put their blind faith in things that they. I've never seen nor experienced before. It's a good way of explaining. The deities are mostly evil, neutral at best. Is there a place in Eldilon I could learn more about religion? No, there's plenty of places. There's temples to the main gods, there's libraries, there's, you know. Everything you could hope for, for this type of research. Is there a god that, I don't know, nature, animals, that sort of thing? The wild mother. Wild Even mother. That comes. Like the sound Some of mind. that? Though, in your research, you might find one that might speak to you more. It may not just be nature. You might find yourself having a calling. Some do. Some some want to go for one, and then the research of another find themselves inexplicably drawn, even if their ideals don't match up. Religion's a funny thing like that. Thank you. I appreciate that. I'm the, the one to decide. And if anything, if you need any help with, well, you're about to be on a diplomatic mission, and I know you have experience, but if you need any advice for stuff like that, it's. I've done my travels. I've had to deal with a lot of people. I'm more than happy to help. Would you? Accompany me with this oh, temple? Of course. Anything you need and wish. I'm happy Appreciate to be your that. guide in Eldalon. Thank you. And you've guided us here in this jungle. Appreciate that. And I'll kind of do a sort of same thing Damon did, and I'll, I'll look around mm -hmm. and see if everyone's like asleep. And I'll pull out the the blue orb. Does this have any meaning to you? May I? Of course. Looks at it. Definitely seems magical, but... I gathered that. No idea. She hands it back to you. Thank you. Where'd you find it? <sighs> I found it under the Hydra. That chest where I found the emeralds. This was in it as well. Hmm. I still to keep it secret and safe until I knew what was up with it. Don't want to alert the others considering what we've been through. I'm Anything sure like this could be dangerous. smart people in New Darum, that could. Or New Darum and Eldolon. 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 That could figure out what it does. I'm gonna try and keep it on the down low though. Again, don't wanna panic them over something that could either be useless or something that could be super dangerous. Okay. These people are prone um, to overthinking as you've probably seen. Actually. Nah, no, never mind. Never mind, never mind. Never mind. That's fine. <laughs> yes. I misread something. Yeah. All right. Well, um, it's about our watch over. Uh, yeah. Should we wake up? Uh, I'll wake up. I'll look for Kess and see if she's not <laughs> about. And I'll like tap on her vessel, like on the little. Is the can I find the vessel thing? Um, she's oh, probably it? back at this point. <laughs> oh, you're back. If she okay. knew her watch. It's the was end of second of watch. Yeah. 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 I will. I will wake up Kess and just be like. Oh, decided to join us for this evening, have you? And 
Don't act like you know things just because you've seen <laughs> one thing. <laughs> I'm messing with you, don't worry. Mm -hmm. And I'll wake up Daigon as well. Time to wake up. <clears throat> Have a good night. And I will give uh, Kess the 60 feet. No, the, no, I can't do it. Never mind. That I lied. I've done it. Already. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bit longer. All right. So for this watch, uh, anything you guys yeah. want to do? Yeah, I want to. And everything going forward is just done in sign language just to save me saying that every time. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I uh, ask Kes. Fucking Naruto um, fucking. So, yeah, right. <laughs> so you mentioned you had a chat with Elsinil the other night. Yeah. I'm just wondering how it went. Irene Considering, I mean, um, do... fuck it, yeah, Deafen. Yeah, probably. Is she still banging that cute bard? I'm <laughs> <laughs> being kept in the way for or just to bang. <laughs> All right. Um, so I'm like considering our new involvement with her. I'm just wondering how it went. She wanted to say that. Um, besides things that only matter to me. Um, she really wants us to take that job Jolly mentioned. Did she say why? Jolly didn't make it sound very pressing. No, she said as soon as we had time. And that uh, we had her blessing to involve the others in the group on a need-to-know basis, of course. Okay. Uh, okay. Well, that's interesting. I just wanted to be sure if there wasn't cause for concern or... No. Also, just how did she appear? Because I know you knew of her, but as was, you this kinda, was the first time as you you'd seen her, this, correct? You suddenly feel a gust of wind and to the right oh, of no. you. To the right of you, Daigon. Oh, no! <laughs> appears this tall fey being long eyebrows, long pointy ears, uh, wearing a, a green cloak, sits down beside you. She looked appeared just like that. I did do the like, ah, Jesus, like a bit of a jump. Hope she didn't normally I, I take hear it everything that personally appears. Personally, that I approached Yes, first? It's nothing personal. I just nod, no. You seem a little more hesitant, worried, perhaps? Anything I can do to maybe alleviate these worries? Answer some questions? Maybe hug it out? <laughs> <laughs> um, I, I, I just sign to, to Kes, because also still I'm assuming, like, yeah, but I don't, I don't know if she knows <clears> things again. <throat> um, um, it's, it's just hard to trust given my background and traveling with these people it's just uh, it, the quote is already used up pretty high this is a lot for me i understand it is difficult you know did i bit of translate that I, I, nope. I jump a little bit when she just answers so i'm like oh fuck okay getting, well um, i didn't need to do that <laughs> you know being well i guess they didn't execute you but they sure tried for things you didn't do I understand, though that can definitely put it's a bit of a buzzkill, right? As far as this whole trust thing goes, so I, I get it, I get it. Anything I can promise you that I don't have any intentions of hanging you? Hmm? <laughs> I say I do have one, and again, just signing now, but this mm -hmm. time directed at Elsa Nil, now that no, she understands. I do have one question, and not to offend, but I don't know a less impolite way to phrase this. It's fine. If if you're a, a newly ascended god, you have this power, how come you need people like us to steal these items for you? Now that is a good question. Part of what makes a deity strong is the amount of people worshipping. Which is why I involve people in my duties. Word spreads. They work for me. In exchange, get rewarded. My popularity grows. My power grows. Okay, I just nod. And do like, okay, I guess... Sure, could I do this all on my own? Sense. Probably, but... 
quite boring, isn't it? Mm. I like fun. I like friends. I like visiting people. I like talking, interacting. If I do it all by my lonesome, sure I could in theory, but I think I'd rather gouge my own eyes out, to be honest. <laughs> um, okay, then I'll say one last question since you're being so generous with your time. Mm -hmm. Well, um, say, well, uh, I'm here, but I'm also in about 10 other places at the same time right now, so you're fine. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, again, not to be rude, I just. Mm -hmm. Religion's not a big thing where I come from. I don't talk to gods a lot. Um, well, you don't talk in general. Sorry. 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 Fair. Sorry. True. Uh, um, <laughs> how... So followers equal power, but... <laughs> can you give us any way to trust that... You Like, when you... If you... At any point, if you acquire what you deem enough followers, is there any security... For those who are involved in doing these deeds for you, that they won't just be, we won't just be discarded when we're done and bad things happen to us in the name of what we've done for a newer deity. It's hard to explain Get it? my question. Um, I don't really quite know what I'm asking anymore. I'm I confused. could tell you. Well, I, what I'm getting is you want almost a bit of a show of proof that I don't have some overlying plan that will betray everyone? Is that what I'm getting here? Still, we're still on the trust thing, that's that's for sure. Um, yeah. Remember that artifact I had you fetch? The amulet, yes. Mm -hmm. She, uh, puts her hand on your, on your shoulder and puts her other hand on, on Does it on feel Kessa's like shoulder. she's physically there when yeah. she touches yes. the shoulder? Okay. Yes. Whoa. And both your vision mm -hmm. Goes 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 dark, and then as you blink, Aye. you see Eldilon. Okay. Eldilon completely torn apart. This Ooh. is what would have happened to Eldilon should you have not stolen that amulet for me. I don't know how, what I would have, but I just trying to use any senses, like even just like s smell, sound of her heart beating, cruising, inside check. Like, do I believe? Do I think she's just showing us an image, or, or do I think that's actually true? Make an inside check. Can I do the same with like passive insight? Sure. Oh, oh, I rolled okay. Oh, um, I don't know. Uh, 21. 21. Ooh, nice. You get the sense yeah. that she's being truthful, yeah? Okay, okay. Now, uh, as she kind of like pulls you back out of this vision, she reaches into her pocket, holds her hand out, and in her hand, you see the amulet snapped in half. Oh, I destroyed it. No more threat. Do I keep some of the artifacts? Sure. Some of them have a use. Some of them can be used to do good. This one, however, hmm, I had to get rid of it. Okay. What was it? Um, let's just say that it was an artifact that um has had some dubious owners. Um, particularly... Well... It hails from a far realm. Very powerful, very dangerous, and the man that was looking for it, or still is looking for it probably, but doesn't know it's destroyed yet, <laughs> don't tell him. Um, very evil. Very evil. And now, without this amulet, part of his powers are gone. Which is a good thing. Okay. Trust me. Okay, I'll just sign back. I feel a little better now. Thank you for revealing yourself. I got the sense that I kind of had to... Anyway, I'll be out of your hair. Good talk. Hope you like the spiders. <laughs> that had me...
pleasantly <laughs> surprised. Didn't expect you to <laughs> take my take my advice so literally, but I'm glad you did. It was funny. You wouldn't be able to just summon some itching powder by any chance, <laughs> would you? Just just to have. Make a persuasion check. Yeah. Uh, okay. Where's the modifier? Uh, yo, that's a minus one. Uh, 13. She reaches in her back pocket and pulls out a little pouch. Yo! <laughs> kind of like puts it down, uh, puts it down uh, beside you, Daigon. Should be enough for about 10 attempts at fun or so. Oh, shit. Oh, anyway, with so that, much mayhem um, with this. I have to go. Is there ever anything you want to discuss or you want to have more of these sit-downs? Just, um, you know. Make it known that you like a chat and I'll try my best to respond. And she kind of like twirls, and as she twirls, the mantle kind of twirls with it, and it keeps going faster and faster and faster until she's gone. Okay. <clears throat> I'll just uh, sign to guess. She seems kind of fun. I know, right? <laughs> Hence the spiders. <clears throat> And I'll say, I don't think we should use this itching powder on our no, party members, you know, no, right away. But, like, no. if they piss us off or if then someone absolutely. else travels with us, like, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. okay, cool. Yeah. Same page. That, and, then, uh... and then we'll just go back to watch, yeah. Okay. Oh, oh Duke's man. gone, bro. Yeah, I mean, that's his, that's his fucking problem. Yeah. All right. Uh, so that's your watch. Koiba. That's your watch. Oh, that's your watch done. Yeah, Koiba's back. Uh, who was who at last watch? Jax. Jax, wasn't it? Yeah. Okay. We'll just say that Jax's so we'll watch goes by Jax. swimmingly, because Sokka's not here to RP, <laughs> so... And with that, you all, uh, wake up on the, uh, 24th? 23rd? 24th? 22nd. No, 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 it's 23rd. 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 Right. Okay. Long um, rest, baby! You long oh. rested, you leveled up. <gasps> Yay! Yay! We're gonna end the session. Here. Wait, wait. Petition to tell Duke we didn't level up, and we'll all, as a group, be like, "Yeah, no, it didn't happen because he's not yeah. undeafened yet." No. <laughs> hey, Duke. <laughs> all right. Hey, Duke. Well, you wake up after your long rest, and uh, I'll thatch, uh, the session. Oh, for fuck's Woo! sake! What? Well, why did I go piss? I knew it was the end. Yeah, you didn't know. miss anything. <laughs> Jax's watch was uneventful. That's yep. it. Yep. It's now the twenty-third. No level up. No exciting happy. Sorry? What was that? <laughs> That's no uh, safe psych right now. It, it, is, it is a psych. It's a psych. It's a psych. It's no a bird for you, man. Oh, we uh do you want us to roll HP now? Uh yeah, sure. Oh hell yeah. Oh think I'll get a deep. Brooks fucking yeah, comes yeah. out of the tent and is not wearing his vest today. Wow. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, oh, wow. I rolled mainly because it's caked in fucking blood. Even his yeah. shirt has a little bit of blood on Rode it. Rolled a three, baby. <laughs> what am Yo, I leveling in? I need to check my see... fucking guide. Where do you see your hit dice again on D&D Beyond? Uh, if, you you're just... if you're playing a monk, it's a D8. Max health! Think, yeah. if, if you just, like, when you go to like, change your oh, yeah. HP value and you click it, it'll tell you. <gasps> Pog! I rolled an eight, too! I rolled a fucking three. I want to die. Go Bug fuck yourself. Dude. It's happened again, baby. Max health. All right, all right, all right, all right. Okay, I'm gonna take a level Bitch. in monk. Yeah, you are. Okay, those key points. Um, pact of the chain, oh, dude. Oh fuck yeah! I get spells. I get to fucking choose now. I get... Right. I get second level spells. Woo! Yo, second level spells. Hell yeah! Where's spiritual weapon? Yoink. <laughs> <laughs> Cool, yeah, I'll fucking take it, baby. baby. Alrighty, man, that was a uh, that was a Very session, huh? That was, oh, that that was, was indeed a session. Fucking hell! You leveled up. You finally level three. Archetype time. Let's go. Archetype. I wish. 
I mean, yeah, for everyone besides you. <laughs> um, awesome. And, and Elazarin, who has one Dude, anyway. That fight mm. was intense, oh. let me tell you. Whoa. Holy shit. Where the fuck do that I get to That was fucking scary. The natural one mean? that Duke rolled really made the fight, that, that part, like, unnecessarily oh, that was fucking stressful. intense. Yeah. I was just but, like, uh, this is fine, we got this, and that one. <laughs> 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 All right. Jirog, take care. Congrats again on winning the Baldur's Gate giveaway. Hope the game runs smoothly for you, my king. Yeah. Um, dude, good session, boys. Level up. You guys are level three now, which means um, Stork next week. Stork. And I have a yeah. sprite. And everyone's. I'm just gonna pretend it was because of the stone. And I can astral <laughs> project, nice. bitch. Nice, nice. I can I hit think. things. I can, um... I can yes, I can, Ethan. Now. Good job, man. Good job. <laughs> Yay! I can now hit more things, All right. by the way. Thanks so much for watching, everybody. Thanks for being here. Mr. Jonesy and uh, Almighty Garldorf, Chris, homie. Thanks for the for the heckin' follows, guys. Getting closer and closer to 200, which is very cool. Um, oh, my God. Do you know how close I am to 1,000? Pretty close. Yeah. Like 20 away? That's fucking nutty. Woo! Um, that's dope. Also shit. my stream of us three? Been streaming for five years. Let's go. Y'all are awesome. I appreciate y'all. We'll be live on the channel tomorrow with Baldur's Gate. Uh, is anyone live? Anyone that we care Sage about? is live. Oh, Sage is live. Fuck yeah, let's raid Sage. As always, yeah. So. Hold on. Let's fucking go raid um, Rocket Surge. Is you muted still? Nice. <clears throat> Sage is awesome. She is uh, part of the level select founders and community she's dope she's smart as fuck Great. she does edu educational stuff and, and she's nominated for the uh, game hers award for educational True. content so y'all should go vote for we'll her support her she's awesome uh yeah. we fucking love her around here and i'll catch you guys uh tomorrow over here for Baldur's gate with uh ethan and uh duke then to discourse on sunday that's it Thursday. yep we can do it awesome Cool. Oh, I can actually do it this time. Me. I can actually do oh, it this time. Yeah. I can actually do it this time. I just awesome. said, no matter what, even if I've got other plans, fuck them. <laughs> <laughs> fuck them. Right. So we'll have uh, Bell and Koiba on uh, Discourse this Thursday. Yay. And we'll be uh, here again next Sunday for session seven. Have a good night, everybody. Yes. Hope you had a great weekend. Dope. Follow us on Twitter. Listen to uh, Dungeon Select on Spotify and Pocket Casts as of now. Mm. Uh, check out the YouTube. All the content goes up there as well. Appreciate y'all. Can I borrow you after this, by the way? Catch you yes. uh, next time. Bye bye. 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 Get those those dulcet boarding school vocals.